dragon fight in a few minutes however some announcements before we begin uh still working on fighting an alternative to uh card slash the other one just yeah 
not a lot of not a lot of alternatives out there, which sucks. Anyways, uh, we also have a Tiltify page where we raise money for Color of Change. We put that in our VODs, so you can check that out as well and raise money for a good cause. Uh, we've got some Etsy stores to talk about. Hey, I have an Etsy store that I can talk about. Um, speaking of, my main Etsy store, Craft Studios, uh, is available to order custom commissions. I'm currently working on one right now, uh, but if you check out the link in the chat that Justin is about to or has already posted, uh, you can uh, order a custom for, uh, I think I listed it as like a dollar just to reserve like, hey, this is what I want because Etsy, Etsy won't let you list stuff for free. Um, but it's just like, you know, a deposit to get your name in the window. And if you don't decide you don't want anything, you can get a refund for your dollar. Um, but yeah, you can ask for almost anything to get commissioned. I make plushies uh, and a bunch of like custom dice bags uh, and all that jazz. Or you can visit my other shop, uh, Bad Dice Co., also on Etsy, and get some awesome D&D themed stickers and or custom dice. Check them out. Thanks. Back to you, Justin. Uh, we also have a anniversary stream coming up Wednesday, July 13th, which will be in my setting in a weird sort of uh, conflict in the past, and that'll be DM'd by Lex over there. Uh, in lieu of sort of what we're, we're testing out, how things are going to go for our next campaign that will be filling up this Wednesday slot, where Lex and I will be taking turns alternating DMing and DMing and also playing and it's going to be interesting it's going to be fun and that'll be July 13th at our usual time so come on out Lex you want, you need, do you want to say anything about it or nope it'll be a surprise it'll Excellent. be a nice fun surprise it'll be nice it won't be terrible and it will be cataclysmic scary. and everyone will die okay mm -hmm. excellent we'll hope so Yay! Um, Codex Legendarium should be back this coming Sunday. Yeah. Excited. We've got a dungeon to go through. Yay! Speaking of dungeons and dragons... You know, dragon tonight. Anyways. The last we left off, the Faust and the Furious slept the night in Kenna's house, with Dax retiring to a nearby inn due to some painful memories tied to the house. Mom dust. Upon awakening, they made their way for breakfast to the Glutton for Bunishment, had some experimental croissants stuffed with whipped cream and raspberries, and headed to the Wayfarer's Guild to scoop up some more jobs to do, because now that you're Tier 3, you can get three contracts at once with no expiry date on them. You acquired the contracts titled Lost in the Catacombs, which seems to deal, deal with a man's brother having gone missing, after attempting to sneak into the crypts beneath the halls of eternal life. That was a Ven ask. But mm. Did not take not go do it, because Sam wasn't here and I want Sam here for that one. Uh, that makes sense. One Appreciate called uh, Winds of Hollyshire that seems to detail people disappearing in the settlement of Hollyshire after strong winds started coming down from the mountains. Uh, and the final contract was for a job titled Missing Farm Animals which seems to involve a farmer's livestock going missing under mysterious circumstances in the town of Argent in the Verdant Shores. Uh, Kenna mentioned an interest into going to Hollyshire due to an invitation they received from someone who seemed to be one of their half-siblings, named Richmond Springs. However, the party agreed to tackle the farm animal contract first and used transport via plants to get into the fell swamps and made their way towards the town of Argent in the Verdant Shores to meet this farmer. While on the road, a couple members of the party gain levels of exhaustion from biting insects carrying sicknesses and disease, and the Faust and the Furious happened upon the town of Sil Solbrand, which had no crown presence whatsoever, which was weird, and it appeared the town had been put under some quarantine, with every building in town being barred shut. People, people were visible in these buildings and were covered in horrific seeping boils and pustules. They weren't undead, but seemed incredibly sick and contagious. While Coin was investigating the surroundings inside one of the buildings, Drux seemed to notice that for the last few days, or sort of realized for the last few days, 
none of you had seen had not seen any large animals game specifically and had seen small animals staring at the group unmoving like rabbits a wild rabbit stared at the party for a while and after it began hopping away Druk felled it with a shot and as this occurred something large slammed into the ground somewhere in town coin and Druk hit just in time as a massive adult green dragon made its way through town and came upon the others who didn't hide in time. So, as I pull Caleb in here, uh, Garrett, can you handle uh, the astral stuff for Caleb, like behind the scenes or something? Because I don't want to. Uh, he signed in. Oh, I, don't I just saw him. He signed up. Okay, because I don't want to. It, it, it gave a little notify on oh, astral. Okay, because I don't want to. Get that going. Okay, so we're going. We're gonna laugh. I got to just so you know, Cape. Okay, we are streaming right now, so it's on. We're on. All right, I'm gonna rearrange all the stream windows. Bear with me. Everyone pre-rolled initiative, so that's good. Coin got a twenty-two. Did we? Yeah. Just to get it out of the way. Perfect. And that's on. I just joined the game. I just click start playing. Yep. And you'll still need D&D Beyond, obviously. Right on. Because we're just using Astral for map stuff. Yeah, I, I think I'm in. I think I'm. You are. All right. Where is Lex? Where is Lex's little window? There we go. If I can't find Lex, Lex, Lex is just going to die in this encounter, so that's fine. Lex is just like... <laughs> Adios! Just like Thursday night all <laughs> The wind again. took me away. <laughs> hey, nothing else. You just take your take your cloak and go like this. <laughs> all right. <laughs> the wind so, <laughs> recap done. As both Druck and Coin hide just in time from this adult green dragon, the rest of you aren't so lucky as you see this massive adult green dragon walking with a bipedal gait pulling itself along on the nearby buildings towards you as it lowers its head and the rain comes down in bullets the wind a flash of lightning reveals the corpse of a massive gargantuan bird sprawled out in the center of town its head nearly torn clean from the body blood pooling into the dirt and stone this was a thud that you all heard and felt the adult green dragon had felled a rock. Now, for those of you that weren't here last week, I'm going to describe the dragon, because I like unique dragons. The dragon has a short and stocky body and isn't as long as most dragons of her origin or size. Atop the head of the dragon is a crown of antler-like jagged horns. A large scar runs from just below her lower jaw and runs along the entirety of her underbelly to the start of her tail. When she moves, she almost takes on a tall bipedal gait, using her front claws to pull herself along. Her eyes are a vibrant, almost icy blue, and about halfway down her tail, the scales go from vibrant green to very pale, ghostly white. And beneath each of her lot, beneath each of her eyes, much like the red dragon you fought in the volcano, are a set of runes engraved into the scales that glow a dull green. She's about 15 feet away from the four of you that didn't hide, or hide in time, and her large tongue looks her jaws found you and that's what we're gonna start i'm gonna add everyone's tokens to the map now and switch you all over to the battle map as soon as i find out how to do that what's this city called again soul brand i'm gonna be adding your tokens where you'd be hiding oh coins already on here perfect my brand my, my brand <laughs> all right and then Obviously, the squishy little spellcasters are going to be in the back. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, I said 15 feet away. You'd be a little closer. That's fine. For clarification, is everyone else only seeing... You're seeing what, what? you see on the map. Mm. It's, yeah, I guess it's Dynamic a Dynamic lighting. You're seeing yeah, what you the... see on the map. Okay. I'm, I'm still on the. Yeah, I'm national. working on it. Just trying to find all your okay. tokens. Never mind. 
Thank you so much. I appreciate your patience. I just wanted yeah, to what you see make on the sure map I wasn't is what you with see. The new system. And if I click cool. on, also, when you're wandering around the map, just so we can all get everyone sorted out on the mechanics of how this new VTT works, uh, you'll see little gray bars on doors, where doors are. If you walk up to those and click on them, the door will open. Mm. Oh. Fun. You also, if you see one that doesn't have a gray bar on it, that's a window that you can see through. It makes it pretty okay. simple. Mm. Now, you jump through it. The windows are all nailed shut, but <laughs> as Coin found out last week. However, oh, that's right, that's right, yeah. <laughs> oh, music! <gasps> this song that's is called good. "Dark Eater Madeir." We'll see if I get Dude. in for using it. Uh, <laughs> I also have to tell you guys, I was at a game shop today and saw an adult green dragon model, and I was like, yeah. Awesome. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Two questions really quick, Justin. Yeah. One, um, did Ven have the presence of mind to cast uh, uh, Mage Armor at the beginning of today? Uh, nope, because you thought it was just a traveling session. So it okay. didn't really happen. Anyways. Flitz does it. Flitz does it because it's just at will. Oh, you okay. Flitz Anyways. has it at will, so he could just do that. Anyways. Okay. Coin, uh, you're first. Okay. Oh, okay. And what's up, yeah. Sam? Sorry. I was going to say, second question. What is the size category of the dragon? Uh, you don't know. Problem. Huge. Okay. But Good Coy, to know. You're up first. What you can see is what you can see. You can hear the dragon, and you can hear it go, I found you. Uh, hmm. Each square is five feet. Again, it's heavy wind and heavy rain, which means disadvantage on perception checks relied on hearing and sight, and uh, ranged weapon attacks have disadvantage as well because of the, ra uh, the wind. And flying creatures have to land at the end of their turn or they fall. Okay. Yeah. Unless All it's right. magical flight, Unless right? Unless it's magical flight. Which is not magical flight. When you use your wings. Correct. Mm -hmm. um, great. And you do remember uh -huh. that there were those infected individuals barred inside these buildings. Right. And that the uh, it can use animals to see. Correct. The dragon can, yes. Cool. At least that's what we've ascertained. Yes. Um, Green dragons are fun. Uh, all right. I'm going to... How many squares? One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I'm going to go... Ooh, oh, I'd use that wrong. Uh, right click. Ooh. Okay. There's that. Get over there. Oh, I should see if this is snapping to the grid real quick. One, two, three. Six. Wait, which direction? Hold on. Sorry, I'm trying to see anything. Like, which even... I guess... What? I'm so sorry. For clarification, I was able to hide. Yeah. Which direction was I hiding from? Uh, directly ahead of where all your friends were standing. So... Via I can't, to the I, west. I can't, you can't ping on here. Is it, so, oh. To the, the west. west of us. Thank you. Sorry, so that's right. So then I was ha hiding on the east side of the wall. Okay. Yep. Then I am going to stand out or move. Uh, oh, boy. Thank you all for your patience. We're learning a new system. Uh, I, I, it, You can move my guy. I want to stand in front of the group. I'll stand out in the middle. Uh, and I want to, like, go towards the, the dragon. And uh, Coin will say, in as big a voice, full height, Du bist Mull, und ich bin Mullman. This is the biggest dragon you've ever seen. Uh huh. It's got about a, it's about a large dragon. It have a pretty decent sized wingspan. It's about twenty five feet tall. Yeah. But it's also, not, but it's not on all fours, so it's bipedal. So it's a little taller than twenty five feet on its hind legs. So it's easily ten times my height. Oh, 100%, yeah. Uh, then I guess I'm going to close the distance and try and hit this fool. Go for it. Uh, what's that at? I love dragons. Right. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, here we go. Where's this? Jeez, it's, a lot, it's a lot of new things to, to juggle, because now I need Move a lot of tabs. <laughs> All right. Um, then 
uh, bonus action, uh, uh, Hunter's Mark. Alrighty. And then, uh, I'm gonna attack with my, uh, with my saber out. Sounds... Just, uh, the, with the short sword, yeah, with the unextended blade. Yeah, sounds good. Just a regular strike. I like the idea of like <laughs> this thing lands and then Corn, Corn and I, Corn and Druck just go <laughs> parting, leave, seeing like leaving all these other people standing there like, ah, shit. <laughs> and then Corn just goes, whoom, <laughs> and just beelines it right for this guy. And he's just like, what? <laughs> All right, Hunter's Mark is Castle on the Dragon. Uh, 26 to hit. That does hit. Right on. Uh, so then... Uh, As you hit it to... with the sword, you get a sense you're the first thing that's fought back against this thing in a very, 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 very long time. And uh, it seems yeah. to enjoy that. It kind of just looks at you and purrs almost like a cat. Mm-hmm. Sorry, I might go to my just my regular dice because D and D Beyond is rolling hella slow. Uh, that's so eleven that's damage. Eleven damage, and then uh, I'm going to smite, which is how many D eight is that? Uh, Two D eight if you're doing it at a second level. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what is it at a first level? Do you not smite at a first level? Oh, okay. it's, sorry. Yeah, two D eight at first level. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna do a second level smite, so 3d8. Alright. Um, so that's uh, 6 plus 8, 14, plus 6, which is 20, so that's 31 all day, plus the hunter's mark, which is another 2. So 33 okay. for the first attack. Also, don't forget to roll an extra 2d6 radiant damage, because this is an evil dragon. And you have the platinum fader square, and it does extra damage to evil dragons. So 2d6 uh, uh, in addition? Yep. So 33. So yep. That's four. And just and as a reminder, two, you have an advantage on saving throws against breath weapons. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. So that's uh, 39 for the first attack. 39 nice. damage. Nice. Uh, all right. And then I'm going to quickly move on to the next attack, because that's just what I'm going to do this turn. Uh, so another attack is going to, let's see if it will actually not be wicked slow. Come on, D&D Beyond. I believe in you. You're my friend. You're my ally. Oh boy, you are slow, friend. Let's get other dice ready. Oh, don't don't linger so cockily on the on the critical. Uh, so uh, twenty six. Twenty six hits. Perfect. Uh, so here's ten. Uh, I got a ten. So that's a uh, what is it? Uh, so oh wait, oh no, oh, shoot! I'm rolling a D eight for damage. Sorry. So. Wasted a 10. Uh, so that's 2 plus 10. So 12 damage on the first hit. And yeah, don't forget your two 2d6 two radiant. Mm hmm. So 12. Oh, balls. Balls. 2d6 radiant. 1, 3, 5. Uh, so 8 plus 12, 20. Plus another 2 is 22 total. Um, yep. And I'm going to save another. I won't need. I won't use a smite. So that's uh, 22 plus yeah. 39. Uh, 61 yeah. damage uh, oh, yeah. for that first attack and the bonus action was used I've used my movement you have. and that is all if I hit with slasher uh, it speed reduces speed. Yep. yeah it reduces their speed by uh, 10 I believe alright yeah. at the end of your right. turn it's going to use a legendary action and go for a tail attack against you it's just going to swing the tail out at you hmm for a 15 to hit. That is a miss. The, the tail, let's see where it would hit. Oh yeah, the tail like hits the building uh, on the side and it like just takes it a portion of wall. Just... Uh oh. So you know what? Since it took out a portion of wall, we're gonna say... I'll just go quickly onto my dynamic lighting and we will delete some dynamic lighting. How do I do that? I don't know how to do that.
Never mind. Uh, Coin, can Coin reach back, or look back, and say something? Uh, yeah, sure. Watch, mind the mind the broken walls. The nasties may come out. I can't delete the dynamic lighting, which is going to be annoying. Uh, all right. Um. Whatever. Okay. Dragon's turn. Oh boy. All right. Was it the southern building or the northern? Uh, building? the one to the south. One to the south. Got it. Figure it out when you're all doing your stuff. Uh, it's gonna oh. exhale poisonous gas in a sixty foot cone. I need everybody but <sighs> Druk to make uh. Constitution saves. Nobody gets a plus one because no one's within ten feet of coin. But coin gets advantage on this saving throw. You said uh, Constitution, yes. Yes, you get advantage because you're platinum fader swear. Mm-hmm. And Kenna also gets advantage because of the dwarf belt. Oh my God. Um, twenty-two. All right. Also a twenty-two with an at twenty. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Flitz, what'd you get? I might survive this. Forty-eight poison damage. Was that for people who made it or failed it? Uh, for people who made uh, failed it. Okay. Uh, Dax, what'd you get? Eleven, oh, but I am resistant yeah, to poison. Yeah, so everybody else, uh, Kenna, Dax, or Dax, you take 24 poison damage. Then 24 poison damage. Kenna, what'd you get? Oh. I got a, I got a 22. 12 poison damage. I love this belt! Uh, coin, what'd you get? got a 19. Uh, you succeed, so 24 poison damage. So if honestly, with shield evasion, master evasion, if an effect allows half damage on success, you can use my re- I can use my reaction to take Is no damage. Is that for damage. dexterity saves? Only, yeah, only dex saves. It's only for dex oh, saves. Oh, thank you. I, I mm -hmm. didn't see that specifically. So 24, it just said, so yeah. You just said an effect yep, the in, snippets, in the text. The, the so. snippets on D&D Beyond don't show the full text. Uh, Perfect. So coin, thank you guys. 24 poison damage to coin. Uh, does anything happen to those that failed? Like, do they get any conditions? They take 48 poison damage. That you know of. Uh, right, but that I mean, like, of. Dax failed, but yeah. she's resistant, so... But that means that poison she damage. failed, so... Okay. Garrett, stop asking for more stuff. <laughs> I'm just curious if she's poisoned. Yeah. That's all. That's Dragon. important. Poison breath does not make you poisoned. Okay. Alright, you can hear... Oh, and after the breath weapon, it goes... Help your creator outside. All right. Oh you can hear movement in the buildings now. Yeah. And the wall, this wall has been taken out. Well, I figure out how to do that. We'll, we'll get to that. Um, we'll just, I'll just pop the tokens out. We'll just ignore that. All right. Um, that's going to bring us to the first of these little guys. Nope, not over there. Where are you? Also, fun fact, you guys can click, hold down on the map and drag it around and move it around if you want. Oh, cool. You can actually do that. It's fun. Alrighty, so... Where are they? Here they are. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. You hear a window smash. And 5, 10, 15... 2530. You can see one of the uh, infected people covered in pustules and boils that are seeping. Long draconic claws have grown out from their fingernail beds and they've started to grow like dragon like teeth in their mouth. Uh, action. Alright. Coin, you see two of them come out of the house to your right. Alrighty. Cool beans. Dax! Okay, so I'll go... Five... Ten... I can now see these two... Oh, coin, I just make a concentration check for Hunter's Mark. Because of the breath weapon. DC 12. Constitution saving throw. It's a 14. Hunter's Mark's still up. Go to here. And then I will 
bonus action rage. All right. And so our dragon buddy and... I figured out how to do it. Sorry, I'm excited. Our dragon buddy and oh, our no. two new friends have to make a intelligence save. Excellent. All right, intelligence save. All right, the dragon gets a sixteen. That fails. So legendary resistance it succeeds instead. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. That's one. Uh, and the two of these guys, five and two. Does both fail, so they'll take again these three psychic damage. To be infe infected people. Three psychic damage, and they're stunned. As long as they just stay, hey, they could have to stay there until their next turn, right? Because if they're stunned, they can't do anything. I guess we'll find out. As long as they stay there, they're staying the fuck away from us. I don't have to fight them. Um. I think that worked. Yeah, okay, I tap, sort of deleted that wall. Well, there we go. And then Actually, Dax boom. pulling out this fucking big ass uh, tooth weapon that we got yeah. going there on we here. Go. Wall taken out. And. I'm going to do. Um. What are you doing? Van, you're on deck. Okay. Oh, yeah. A. We're doing great weapon master. Okay. So, well, mi so minus five from the minus attack five. roll. Okay. With the Titan's Tooth Claymore. Yep. Oh, it's a nat 20! Nice. It's a plus 10 to the damage. <gasps> So roll, roll a crit, and then add. Oh, baby! So thirty-four. Oh, so for oh, plus ten. Thirty-four plus, plus your rage my bonus. Rage bonus, which, is a, which, which should be a three. 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 Now, so thirty-seven. <laughs> thirty-seven damage. Interesting. And that is a. Uh, a, a fancy weapon. It's not just a regular weapon. Oh I my know. god, I have a good weapon again! <laughs> it's so and nice. also like your, and It's also your height. And it weighs like 150 pounds. Oh my god! And this one doesn't seem to want to be eating brains. I guess we'll find it's, out. We'll find good. out. We'll seems find out. Idea. Anything else? You have one more attack. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm going to do Great Weapon Master again. Okay. I just rolled a second nat 20. Wow. <laughs> That's awesome! Lordy. Good to know. <laughs> the dice are telling a tale. Tail. Oh my god. Oh my god! That He's back with a vengeance. 41 so damage! Alright, anything because else? 28 plus 10 is 38 plus my rage yes. is 41. Anyth yeah, anything else? Um... <laughs> I'm just gonna deal. Contemplate. Just doing seventy plus damage to a dragon in one, in one um, round is fine. Um, I, I, uh. It looks like it's gonna uh, kill you. It's looking at you like you're the <laughs> target. It's gonna uh, kill you. Uh, but if I move, it's just gonna get an attack of opportunity. Uh, what are you doing? Um, they only get one attack though. You know what? I'm just gonna uh 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 um 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 um. um what are you doing? You don't fuck it. I'm just gonna stand here and help out Cloyd. Cool. End of your turn. It's gonna use a legendary action, and it's gonna come down with a wing attack. So you I know need what? That's valid. just Coin and Dax to make dexterity saving throws. Dax gets a plus one on this because of Coin. Nineteen. With Just coin. succeeds. 
Mine's a 18. Fails. Okay. And that's not a hit. Oh, it's an attack, but it's not a hit. Okay. <clears throat> so, coin, you take 10 bludgeoning damage and are knocked prone. Okay. And the dragon's going to fly away. Um, as it's flying away, I do get a reaction, correct? Uh, with disadvantage, because you're prone. Okay. And, Kai, take an attack of opportunity on two. Uh, yep, it does not say, it, does not, it doesn't provoke opportunity attacks if it does its uh, wing attack flyby, which is, which is stupid, because most legendary creatures do get no opportunity attacks, but... 25? It's going to cast shield. So, miss. Oh! Oh, it's yeah. Well, it's those AC aren't, aren't going to do it. Uh, unless, hold on, twelve. Twenty doesn't do it because you cast. Yeah. Yeah. So it <sighs> lands in a separate area of town. Coin knocked prone. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and it moves ten less feet from my. Yeah, it's still got a lot hit. of flying speed though. For sure. All right. Uh, uh, coin another concentration check for Hunter's Mark. Muted. 17. Still up. Ven. Okay, so it is no longer in line of sight then. Yeah, you cannot see it. Whatever you can see on your map is what you can see. You see the dead rock. Okay. And you can see the two stunned, uh, infected people. Alright, uh, that changes what I was... Can you see both of them? You can see I had both a, of them. I had a plan for my turn. That just messed with it. Um, we're gonna go... With a, that's not gonna make much of a difference. Uh, armor of Agathis. So just raindrops as they land on me, just freeze and start spreading ice on my body into armor. Awesome. And uh, that'll give me some extra health. And then I'm gonna go take cover over here next to Druk. Okay. All right. And then is that that's your turn? Yep. All righty. You can hear more commotion inside one of the buildings. Drunk just looks over. I said to spread out, not... <laughs> this is more spread three. out. Yeah. <laughs> you hear another window shatter somewhere. Just you can barely hear it because of the howling wind, but... Oh, no, that's the wrong one I'm moving around. What? Where are you? Oh, did I move the wrong one? Hold on. Nope. Nope. Where the hell is this guy hiding? Oh, here he is. Ven, you hear a window shatter right between you and Druk. Oh, do, oh, there was a window there? Yeah, right. Yeah. You walked right past it. Oh, I forgot to fucking... I forgot to put it on dynamic lighting. Yeah, there was a window. My bad. Oh. You know what? It's not on the map. It's gonna open a door instead. Okay. I was like, that would have changed where I went. And around to the corner. And just, like, covered in pustules, Druk... You're up against the wall, you see Ven scurry over, you hear the door, the southern door of this building go, and then out lumbers one of these infected individuals, and it rounds the corner on Ven. Oh and dear. it's gonna exhale a 15-foot cone of noxious disease. Stop it! So I need Ven and Druk to make uh, constitution saving throws, DC 13. Nope. What? What's the... Okay. Nope. Yeah. No. Seven. Eleven. Eleven. Ven, you take... Oh, hold on, math. Fourteen poison damage. Okay. Druck, so the Arm is just gone. Druck, you take fourteen poison damage. Mm -hmm. Druck, what'd you roll? Eleven. Or seven. 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 Eight, nine, ten, you fail by five or more, so because of this... Uh, nauseous disease breath, you gain a level of exhaustion. Both of us? Okay. No, what'd you get, Ben, on your save? 11. No, you're good. It's only if you fail by oh, five okay. or more you get a level of exhaustion. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. That's not good. Doesn't recharge that. However, you do hear another one coming through the door.
and it can only get within melee of Ven. So it's gonna make two claw attacks against Ven. Just <laughs> yeah. I thought I was safe here. Uh, the first is a natural twenty. Great. Where is the door they came out of? Uh, you can't see it where you are. Oh, okay. But it, it's it sounds like it's five, ten feet around the corner. Ah. All right. So that is nine slashing damage. All right. And I need you to make a Constitution saving throw, DC twelve. Okay. One second. Fifteen. Okay. You are immune for 24 hours by the disease that these claws inflict. Oh, God. Uh, the second claw attack is a natural one. Oh, good. All right. Flitz, you're up. Flitz is not feeling great. <laughs> um... You can see the two uh, infected people that are coming out for coming down from the south. You cannot see the dragon, and you cannot see the other two infected people. Okay. Uh, what's his plan? Changes a lot. <laughs> um, all right, so he is going to going to do two things. First, he is going to quicken spell a greater invisibility on himself, and with that, he's going to fly up. He wants to get on the roof of the. Um, how tall is the roof? Not tall. Like How two, tall are the they're, two They're two-story buildings, so probably like, I don't know, 20 feet? 25 feet. 20, 20 25 feet. feet. Yeah. He's going to fly up to the uh, the building that didn't get hit. So he's going to fly 10, or I'm sorry, 5, 10, and then he's going to land like here on this corner. Okay. Oh, God, that cool. puts me inside, though. It's fine. Um, There's nothing inside. Right. It's fine. Okay, yeah, yeah. okay, I just need to be able to see out um yeah. all right, oh, right. he is yeah, going yeah um okay so that gives me a few more targets um and you from where there you can from there i believe you can see the dragon just barely oh shit yeah i can okay i see it now um all right um sorry let me use those two up as he flies up he he looks around to the others, um, but the f glint of green through the uh, rain catches his eye. And as he's descending down, he essentially grabs some some air as he's on his way down and lands. And whenever he does, he's going to send three uh, Eldritch Blast in that direction. Towards the dragon? Yes. Alrighty. And he is invisible, so... Yep, you can still see the shimmering of the shield over the dragon oh that's valid yeah okay oh that's a natural one. Oh, come on is that another not that's a two natural one so Brittany, you took all the fucking luck here i'm sorry Bibby. yeah nope that is uh three big old bad fails all three just hit the dragon and the arcane shield just <laughs> and um it looks, and it looks in the direction where they where those came from cool uh he is going to continue with his regular movement because that was his uh that movement but the fly yeah. was part of his uh, gift so he's going to uh scurry and technically your flying is magical yeah but this is a it happens and then i land yeah kind of but thing. it is magical yes. he is going to i'm going to just have him scurry like along the roof okay. here. Like, I, I can't really tell where the building goes, but he's going to yeah. be, like, on top of the roof trying to, like, uh, I don't know, put him there? Sure. Oh, my God, I can't move him anymore. Oh, because of... Why can't I move him anymore? Because dynamic lighting. Oh, got it, got it, got it. He's going to go about, like, right here, right, right above this dude. Okay. Sure. You can just yeah, hear it, like, can't leave. Stun, it's stunned. Like, <laughs> And right. it's going to stay put there. All right. Cool. Flitz, from your vantage point, mm -hmm. uh, you can see... some sexy stuff going on. The first being, I didn't add enough of these tokens to the battle map. Apparently. 
Apparently not. But, uh... Anyways. You see a window shatter and one spills out over here. And a window shatters over here and it spills out around the dragon. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Okay. Brings us to Druk. How high are these walls? Uh, 25 feet. Up to the top of the roof. Well, before my speed was halved, I would have been able to potentially make that. Uh... This isn't good. So these these guys, these uh, infected people, they have a radius of at least 15 feet, right? If they recharge their breath weapon. Right. Only one of them's used it, though. The other one is yep. completely able to just screw people over. Uh. And then count on your own deck. Shit. Uh, Druk's gonna go up to Ven, like, do you want up top? What? What? You throw me over. Can you get me up there? Well, I'm going to find out. Can you throw a person twenty-five feet in the air? Oh no. No? Not with your strength score, no. Oh. Oh. Well then I'll just use my action to move him backwards and switch places with him essentially. Ending my turn. As if Ven allows it. Oh definitely. Okay, so you guys swap places. And it is technically force movement, so attack of opportunity. Exactly. Against Ven, so wait no. If it's force move, if it's force moving, then there wouldn't be an attack opportunity, yeah. right? No, it is. No, it's not. So it's, well, so it's I'm, not. Force I'm, I'm moving him, so it's forced. Well, these things have sent. No, no, no. All right, cool. <laughs> I mean, otherwise, there's really no reason for me to do well, that. So that's is that what you're doing then? Yeah. Okay, cool. Anything else? Yeah. Uh, Sam, could you move? Oh, all right, right. All right, so I have a bonus action. That's probably useless. Yes. Uh, yeah, I only have dash. Um, I guess I'm going to dash and try and take their attention away and move to that spot right there, All like right. skirting them, All right. going around them, and just trying to, like clap in their right. faces since they seem to be zombie-like. Right, Trying to get them away from them. Alright, Kenna. Okay. I'm going to third level cast Healing Word on Ven. Okay. Um, ben, you get 13 HP back. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> and then uh, running running forward, skirting around Dax. I'm gonna get to about here, and whoa, I can see so much other shit. Yeah. <clears throat> um, and I'm going to toll the dead, the dragon. So, wisdom saving okay. throw at disadvantage, please. All right. Where is it? Uh, it toll the dead is a 60 foot range. No, it's, where's the dragon? Ven doesn't know where it is. So. Oh, yeah, you wouldn't be able to see him. <laughs> But I know, that's like, why I'm asking. And also, you won't be able to hear, we'll not be able to hear Kenna call it out because of the wind and loud rain. Yeah. Oh. Yep. Sorry. Uh, the wisdom save is a 15. That's a fail. He takes 3d12 necrotic damage. Nice. Um, one, two, three, four, All right. Six, five, nine, eleven. 20 necrotic damage. Nice. Um. Uh, do, do, do. Um. And then I'm gonna. 
Uh, how heavy are the rock's wings? Extremely. Okay, cool. Gargantuan bird. Yeah. Um, that's a window. That's a window. That's a broken wall. Um, I'm just gonna spread out and go around here. Okay. Um. Yeah, and that'll be my turn. All right, coin. Muted. <laughs> As an action, I'm gonna throw uh, that. Uh, uh, oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw the boomerang. All right, go for it. Uh, what's the range on that? 60 feet. I think 60 optimum, and then 120 is in parentheses. It's the dragon's 55 feet away, so you're good. Uh, with disadvantage, though, because it's a ranged weapon. Great. I will roll that again. So it is 18 hit. 18 misses. So it And I'm going to catch the boomerang yep. back. Uh, and I'm going to... Uh, I guess I, I stood up to throw. So that's yeah, I'd be happy moving to stand up. Yeah, because you're prone. And then I'm going to take a. Uh, uh, I don't know how to do. Press right click to move your guy. Okay. Left click to move step, your token. Yep. I'm gonna step back uh, the 15 feet and look over at Ven. Mm -hmm. And like, he like like scream and point. In you don't hear coin screaming. Uh, five, ten, fifteen, twenty. You hear coins barely screaming. But you, you can, can barely hear coin. But you can see coin pointing in the direction. Yeah, and like okay, like trying to make like <laughs> as okay. much which, sense as it's way over there. Okay, which which direction is he pointing? Just straight yes. left or left? Uh, I'm pointing. Yeah, uh, I am pointing southwest. If I southwest, ish. Yeah. If I'm looking at you, mm -hmm. I'd be pointing, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah. so like on the other side of the building. Directly me, west right from Ben. Just to yes. make things okay. simple. Right on the other side <laughs> of the building, cool. Uh, A little bit further cool. than that. Okay. And yeah. then, uh, bonus action, I'm going to uh, extend the fader short. Okay, cool. Yep. All right, dragon turn. Flitz, That's Stax, fine. Kenna. Dr uh, Druk? Nope, Druk can't see the what? dragon. Uh, Flitz, Dax, Kenna, Coin. I'll watch the dragon just go invisible. Did it cast a spell? It did. It's gonna. I'm gonna counter spell. Fourth level. You counter spell its invisibility spell. Ooh, nice. Yes. I didn't want to use it so soon, but Interesting. <laughs> All right. this is bad. All right. All right. Whatever. Recharges its breath weapon, though. And it looks oh, right boy. at Flitz. It's, I could see it staring at me. Yeah. Even <laughs> though I'm invisible. <laughs> oh, right. Uh, that, sorry, I'm just making you sure that's... You would have used an action, though, wouldn't you? When you did Eldritch Blast, you'd be it's invisible. A, no, it's greater invisibility. It's greater invisibility. <laughs> oh, right. Cool. Okay. So I yeah. threw it at the really corner. Good. I did it at the corner, and then okay, I ran no, away from okay. that corner. But I just did counter spell. Okay. But I don't know how that okay. Okay. would work mm -hmm. okay. with okay. revealing okay. my location. Okay. 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 All right. So uh, these two guys are no longer stunned, bringing us to Dax. So, two questions. One, the dragon is on the ground, right? Yeah. Second question. Um, this bird thingy that's on the ground, um, is it, like, straight on the ground, or is there any way you can walk under it like a dinosaur No, you have to bones? walk on top of it. Okay. It's a massive corpse, too, so it's... Anyone okay. trying to walk on the rock is difficult terrain. Okay. You cannot reach the dragon with your movement. I cannot reach the dragon with my movement, but 
I nope. could attempt to shoot it. So what are you doing? Um. All ranged weapons have disadvantage. Yeah, I believe Druk gave you his plus one crossbow. Yeah. yeah. So what are you doing? I'm gonna then move. Then you're on deck. Okay. Um, 5, 10, 15, 20. Get about there. Okay. From right here, just for how the bird is. But the dragon's huge, so I can still yeah, shoot it. You can still it. see like, the I can dragon, still... yeah. Okay, I just, with how the bird... The bird is gargantuan, but the way it's been sprawled on the ground, it's not really covering anything. Okay, just want to know. Okay, I'm gonna try to shoot it with Druk's crossbow. Okay, disadvantage. Oh. At least you keep your rage up by doing this. So. Oh. Uh. Oh, damn it. Ten. Okay. The, it was a nat twenty and a three. Do you three. have crossbow bolts? I have whatever drug. Okay, so delete. Did. Make sure you delete the crossbow bolts. Cause that one you just. Yeah. Uh. Every time you shoot, uh, just minus one crossbow bolt. Okay. Anything else? Uh. I can do that one more time. Uh, depends if the weapon yes. has the loading property. So no, you can't. It has the loading property. Okay, I can't. Uh, we're just uh uh uh. Because you attack and fire as you, you load and fire as part of the attack action. You can only attack once with a loading property weapon. Okay. Fine. Uh, yeah. I'll just um I'm just I'm just gonna stay there. Alrighty. Then key. Oh wait, legendary action. They got those back. Oh dear. Yeah, I got those back. Wing attack, but no one's within the radius except for this dude. So actually, he'll have to make the save. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, that. <laughs> uh. <laughs> that's six plus five, eleven plus six. Oh yeah, that guy's just. <laughs> Gone. Oh no, 11 plus 6, that's only 17. So he's, he's still up, but he's not prone. So, let's you see that happen. Uh, and that guy's not prone, and the dragon is gonna start going this way. And land. <laughs> so. Kenna, Dax, Flitz, and Coin would see that it is flying west out of town, and then it lands. Okay. Bringing us to... Yeah, Ven! Alright. Let's go to here. Alright. I don't see it. Five, five, six. Okay. So I don't see it anywhere around here. Nope. Okay. Uh, if I went right up next to the rock, would it provide cover? Uh, not really. Just based on how okay. it's laying on the ground. Gotcha. Okay. We got one, two, three, four. Okay, a lot of these, a lot of these infected around us. Um. Okay, Ven is going to go on the defense until he can see the dragon. Cast mirror image. Okay, so three more vents pop up. <laughs> yeah. All right. Anything else? Uh, no, that's it. All righty. Cool beans. Let's bring us to some more of these infected people. Well, drug. Oh wait, never mind. Wrong initiative. Wrong ones. Uh, Kenna, one does approach you, and it's going to position itself. Five, ten. Yay! I can get Dax in that. Oh no! And it's going to do its uh, <laughs> and it exhales this like noxious cloud of disease in a fifteen foot cone. I need you and Dax to make Constitution saving throws. This is for right. disease, but it's technically poison, so you do have advantage, Kenna. Okay, sweet. Uh, rolled shit. Um, 
12. 12 fails, unfortunately. 21. That succeeds. Uh, can you take 11 poison damage, but because you're resistant, you take 5. Sweet. And what'd you get for your save, sorry? I got a 20. 12. Alright, so you don't get a level of exhaustion. And Dex, you take half of that. You take 11. Oh, wait, no. Wrong. And then my, math, my math was wrong. You take uh, 5. Alright, the other one that is there... And Dax, you're immune to that for 24 hours. That's going to bring us to the other one in that cluster. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Oh, boy. Um, wait a second. Oh, I, move, I moved the wrong ones. Sorry, guys, I moved the wrong ones. Ignore the damage that I just dealt to Ken and Dax. I don't remember who this guy was. He was over here. Yeah, ignore that, because it's the ones that are under Flitz that are going next. Yes, B and E. Is that B and E breaking in there? Yeah, these ones, okay. Uh, nope. B, where's E? Fuck's E. Oh, yeah, okay. Two separate groups. Uh, Flitz! They can't see you. So. 5, 10. I'm gonna walk up to Ven. And make some attacks. But mirror image is up, so let's see what happens. First claw attack is a 7. To hit. For Ven. Oh, against Ven, sorry. 7 to hit. I missed that. No, that does not hit. Okay, second attack. Ah! That's cocked. Second attack is a 16 to hit. That does hit. Let me just roll a d20 and see if it's higher than a 6, though. <laughs> Illusion. Excellent. One of the mirror images takes it. All right. Mm -hmm. There we go. And I was right. Sorry. Uh, where is the B one? It's over here somewhere. E. Yeah, okay, so the one that did do the poison breath would have done the poison breath, sorry. So yeah, 11 damage to whoever failed. I don't remember anymore. 5 and 5 to each, I guess. I don't remember what happened. But it was 5 each. Oh no, wait, Kenna took 11 but reduced to 5. That's right, okay. Yeah. Alright, Flitz. Um. Oh, at the end of that turn. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, Flitz. Um, so just in point of order, yeah. uh, I definitely cast two <laughs> spells that are above first level. Oh, right. Roll me two wild surges for your necklace that you yeah. wear. Yeah, okay. I did want to uh, That's right. not do that. That's right. We'll just say they're both okay. delayed and they're happening right now. Oh, my God. Okay, who? That's a 98. 98! You are surrounded by faint ethereal music for oh, the next minute. Wait, it's a thirty. It's a thirty-five percent chance. All oh, right, thirty-five. So there was a roll 30... two percentile dice. Thirty-five. Yeah. So ninety-eight. First one's good. Roll yeah. second one. Eighty-one. Okay, good. No surges. Then I'm okay. Um, right. All right. So, <laughs> well, it's about to happen again. <laughs> Bonus action. He is going to misty step here, like on the back of the rock. Okay. Um. Roll the thirty-five so percentile I will... dice. Yep. <laughs> so you just invisibly like sixty-seven. Okay. No more. No. No other surge. Um. Let's see this fucker again. Um. You can. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. He it does looks have like some their movement. Attempt. They're leaving town and they're going to the west. Okay. He's not gonna let that happen. Um. He is going to, uh, slide down. Um. Okay. And land. So, what, 10, 15... Yeah, if you're sliding down the tail, uh, sure. Sure, yeah, uh, 20, uh, he's gonna get here, uh, full movement, and, uh, so that was bonus action, bonus action. I am invisible, I forgot about this, I have advantage on attacks against you do. unless yeah, you can yeah, see yeah. me. So, um, 
we'll just say Blitz is really fucked up last round. Okay. Um, all right, so I'm going to do Eldritch Blast uh, again, three bolts at him. Get okay, with advantage because you're invisible. So for the first one, oh, you fucking bitch. Uh, that's a 17. That misses. Yep, I have a, it's fucking sitting on a natural 20. Uh, that's a 29 to hit. That hits, so poof, as it's fleeing, you hit it in the back. Okay, I'll do this one. Oof, that's not great. 8 plus 4 is uh, 12. Okay. And then my third bolt. Uh, it's another 29. Hits. <laughs> for 11 force damage. Nice. Actually, Dragon so can hurt. Um, two fucking crits in a row fucking just change the tide completely. So, I'm not here for a week and then I do that shit. Plus anything else? Uh, um. Oh shit. Okay. I'm going to change that a little bit because with casting a first level spell, I can fly 10 feet. So I would have yeah. gone just 10 feet down. So 5, 10 to wherever this was. And then and then started running 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, okay. 30. Getting real close to this thing. And he's just throwing fucking Eldritch okay. Blast at him. Okay. Um, okay. But yeah. Those of you that so. can see Flitz, see Flitz running off and firing Eldritch Blasts. Well, nobody can. <laughs> oh, yeah, no one, People can see Eldritch Blasts coming out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> out of midair, you just see these big... All right. All right, cool. ...balls of air and That's force. That's it? That is going to be it for me. All right. All right. Druck, you successfully distracted these two. Now we're going after Venom. They're going to turn and attack. So claw attack from this first one is a 17 plus 22 to hit. Mm -hmm. Okay. You take 10 slashing damage. And I need a DC 12 Constitution saving throw. Uh, that one. All right, noted. I can write that down. And then the second attack, 13 to hit. Miss. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me see if that's actually a one near you. Sorry, not one near you. My bad. I grouped these tokens together with the wrong ones. The one that's actually moving on this turn is moving towards Flitz. You can see me? Yeah. So C and F were the ones that attacked. So that's the one that's right here near Druk. And then F is the one. Oh, no, I can't. All right, it's just going to move towards the people it can see. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. And it's going to dash to get right up on Kenna. All right. C and F, Druk. Uh, didn't this other one go, too, before my turn? Yeah, like I said, I got, both of them I got, were in I position got the order by the mi time mixed up. So I skipped this turn by accident. So go, your turn. Oh, um, it's giving me the door symbol. Is this door open, or did it close automatically when these guys left? If you can see through it, it's open. Okay, thank you. Um, yeah, Truck's not too happy about this. He doesn't know what's going on. Um, he's only at half speed. I imagine he's kind of limping or something. Uh... Uh, bonus action disengage action dash okay. is going to go here okay and open this door okay and that's, that's it okay Kenna okay <clears throat> I'm going to do a very similar thing to Flitz um, in that I'm going to Misty Step uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 to the other side of the rock. Okay. Um, let me just mark that off. And then I'm going to use both of my wild shapes to wild shape into a wraith. Okay, I don't have token for that on here, but you become a That's wraith. That's fine. 
Um, and then 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Excellent. I'm going to fly 60 feet okay. all the way to the dragon. Okay. Um, um, uh, let me pull up the stats. Um, and I'm going to do... Go away. Um, the life drain attack. Go for it. What's up? Well, while she's rolling that, can I ask a question? Since yep. I was up close and personal with these things, can I tell if they're like undead or if I they're just like? I specified in the recap they're they're not undead. Okay, they're so they're people. just right. They got they got the brain worms. Yeah, so they're not actually like evil. They're right. just sick. Okay. Um, that's only a sixteen to hit. That misses. Okay. Right. Cool. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna. Do you land at the end gonna... of your turn? Huh? Do you land at the end of your turn because you want you use flying? Uh, yeah, I can only hover. Oh right, um, okay, cool. So yeah. All right. Um, <clears throat> so I'm just chilling in front of the dragon. All right, coin. With all of my immunities and resistances. That's right. Like uh, like everyone else, I'm gonna use Misty Step. Hell yeah, uh, everyone's got Misty Step. Misty Step train. <laughs> So I guess that's 30 feet, so that can get me... Yep, to a point you can see. Uh, to a point I can see. I'm pretty sure that can get me here. And, uh... <clears throat> so you miss step, and you appear in front of one of these infected people. Oh, well, I probably wouldn't. You, wouldn't have, you didn't see them, so... I did. Did you? From where Remember? I was, I could see them. Yeah. Oh. I mean, I could well. go back there, I and mean, if I could see them, I'd probably not do that. Um, Alright, uh, then I'm gonna use my flight movement speed to move 60 to okay. get as close as I can. Yeah, I'm right up next to Flitz, then. Alright. And I assume uh, you land. Yeah. yeah. Okay, you'd be in the square opposite flits. Uh, so here? Yep. Let's see his coins coming in, like, we also takes don't, his you feet. Don't, you like... don't see flits either, so you... you <gasps> it, yeah, I mean, if I you don't... Try to, if you I tend don't... to land in flits' space, and you bump into something solid. Uh, give me a second. I want to, like... If technically you're both prob... small creatures, you actually both can occupy the same space. Oh, well, that's true. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. you bump into something solid when you land there that you can't see. But you did see Flitz go invisible and start casting spells, so you know it's Flitz. Uh, so, if Coin does that, then he has this thing. If he feels that, Coin's going to take a half step forward, trying to be inconspicuous, but stand in front of Flitz still. Okay. Like, without being, without being conspicuous. He okay. just stands there. Like, he's just hit an invisible thing. <laughs> well, and, um, Coin's also still swinging the chain. How do you have, a 60, un- how do you have a 60 foot fly speed? Uh, I just dashed, so it's my oh, movement okay. and my I dash. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, so so I used dash to, so it's the only action I could take. Okay. <clears throat> uh, just screaming, coward! Just swinging the sword. Okay. It's gonna bring us to the dragon. He's gonna turn around and. Oh. <laughs> so I need Wraith, Kenna, Flitz, and Coin to make uh, Constitution saves. Flitz, you get a plus one. <laughs> Yay! And also advantage because he can't see, right? You see uh, no, 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 no. This is different. Oh. Uh, oh, is this poison or necrotic it's damage? It's poison breath. Uh, I am immune to poison okay, damage. Okay, because you're a wraith, so never mind. So yeah, just flits and coin. And it's a con save? Yes, please. And I believe you have breath advantage. Weapon, so I have advantage and and yeah. coin has advantage because of your sword. Question. Yep. Would a, because this is part of my talisman, would a d4 say flits with a 13. No. Okay. Well, would, it, work would, a, would a D4 plus a 4 no. if he gets hit? I'm not getting hit, though. It's not It's not getting hit. This is just a, a save and throw. Yeah. Breathe in the right. end. Flits, what'd you get? Oh, yeah, that was a 13. Uh, 56 poison damage. He's down. Okay, so you're. Would you be visible? Yeah, you'd be he visible now. Collapses and he's in, he's visible. All right. So 56 poison damage. Coin, what'd you get? 
Uh, 24. So you take 28 poison damage. Unless, are you resistant to poison damage? Uh, no, I'm resistant. I'm immune to disease. Okay, so frightened. you take 28 poison damage. All righty. So it does that. Breath weapon. It does a sexy little breath weapon. And then it's going to use its movement to just keep running. Kind of, you do get an attack of opportunity on it. Uh, I will take that. Um, okay. even it's, though it's, it's going to run along around 40 feet. Just okay. Um, that is... So it's going to be off the map. But... 20. That's even worse than what I rolled last time, so no. Okay. It's... It runs off the map, but it's still very much in things. <clears throat> Alright. Where are these stupid afflicted things that I keep fucking up their initiative for? 10, 20. Oh! With half movement, it kind of get up to Dax. So it's this one's going to attack Dax with a claw attack. With two claw attacks. So the first one is a th 13. Does not hit. And the second is a 21. That hits. Okay, you take from its claw 5 slashing damage reduced to 2. Okay. And I need you to make a constitution saving throw. Because you are not immune to this. Or you did not succeed on this one yet. Uh. 22. Cool. Now you're immune to that for 24 hours. And then the second... Oh, that's both claw attacks. Never mind. Alright. 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 Here's the one I forgot about. Now I remembered its turn order. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. It's going to dash in the direction that Druk went. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. And Druk, you can use reaction because it got within hostile reach of you. Wait, what? One of these things. Got oh, is it trying to go beyond? It's, it's past going, me? No, it's going after you. Ended its turn in front of you. Okay. And you have a reaction where you can move away from people if they end their turn. Oh, in front of you. yeah, yeah. Sorry, I didn't. I I know that. I was. I just thought that you were saying something else. Nope. Sorry. Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't think I want to do that because okay. I don't know what's away from it. Um, and I need to be able to mitigate damage with that reaction. All right, sounds good. Dex. Uh, at the end of that thing's turn, the dragon's going to use its wing attack action and fly 30 feet and land. So it's even further off the map now. Oh, j for clarification, its wing attack also counts as movement, too? Yeah, because it gets to use movement when it does it. Oh, cool. Yep, so it, go it, it's, it moved 40 and then flew 30. So it's 70 feet further away than it was last turn. Dex. Dax is holding on to their weapon, and you just see these weird spectacle purple tentacles come out of nowhere and encase her as uh, she uses a far step to get 60 feet. That uh, gets her right there, yep. and I'll mark off one of the charges. You can, see, you can see Flip's on the ground, covered in, like, boils from the poison breath dying. Oh! Oh, great heavens. Um, so that's your action to do that. That's a bonus action, actually. Right. Uh, and then that thing is how far away from me at the feet. moment? Uh, it'd be more than 70. It'd be 80, 90, or 75, 80, 85, 90 feet away. I'm going to move 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So it would be like 50 feet ish for me. Sure. And I'm going to use Drux Crossbow. Disadvantage. It is worth it. It's keeping my rage up. I'm going to roll at disadvantage. That's a 14. Misses. Another bolt lost into the swamps. That's okay. All right. Uh, all right. That's your turn. That'd be my turn. Ben. All right. You can see Flitz well. up here and start dying. Oh, okay. One, two, three, four, and you're also within melee of one of these things. 
Great. We're just having a grand old time. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Range on the 60 feet. And coins right there. Yep. Okay. When I get up to here. Attack of opportunity. Yep. 19 plus 5, 24 to hit. Let's see if that actually hits. Uh, where is. Where is there is. Uh, so I got 8 or higher on the d20. Another illusion. All right, cool. We got one left. Anything uh, else? Yes, that was. That gets me up to there. I am going to. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Crossing one. over the Kinda's... rock. Crossing over the rock is still considered difficult terrain, though. I know. I'm not. Yeah. I need to. I need to use my action to. I'm using my action to heal. I just was checking to see who's within sixty feet of me. And it looks like it's coin and uh, coin and flits. Kenna is just out of my range. And you have it people to like. see them, correct? Yeah. Okay. So Ven just like gets up to the rock, leans over it, and reaches out a hand, and is going to cast Mass Cure Wounds. Nice. Oh. So he's only going to get two people with this, but he's going to get coin and flits. Excellent. Uh, so that is going to be. Uh, 17 plus the spell level of 5. 22 hit, 22 hit points. Ooh. Thank you. And I heal. Where'd it go? Uh, 2 plus spell level. I heal by 7. Oh, no, nice. sorry. It's two pl uh, Additional hit points equal to 2 plus the spell level. So did I, what did I say? 22? It's actually 24. Yep. And I get 7. Excellent. Ooh. Alright, anything else, Ben? Uh, nope. This is just me trying to catch up to the fight. Alrighty. Let's bring in some more of these infected dudes. The one who just tried attacking you has his turn, so he's gonna go 5, 10, 15, 20. They come up from behind. Do you have any mirror images left? I think you got one left, I have right? one. I have right. one. Two claw attacks. First one's a 17. Yeah, alright. Let's roll and see. Uh, it needs to be a. Let me check the number. Uh, 11 or higher. 50 50. No, that's a d12. No, get, stop that. A, a 20 is definitely above 11. Thanks, DMD Beyond. Right, I didn't so the, need that. Last last, mirror, the last mirror image takes last it. Last one. The, yep. the person seems confused and goes for another claw attack because they get two of yep, them. Well, I'm the only one left. Uh, 11 to hit. That just misses. Excellent. All righty, then. This one moves now to go 5, 10, 15. To corner you into, like, the, these two, one, the other one comes up and corners you into, like, the tail section of this mm -hmm. rock and is also going to make two attacks against you. Uh, 21 to hit. Oh yeah, and I got nothing left for that. All right, you take nine slashing damage. Okay. And I believe you succeeded on one of these before, so yes, I you did. don't have to worry about that. So the second claw attack is a 18 to hit. Oh yeah. Okay. For 10 slashing damage. So just oof. It's getting mauled And even with your like, with your like, with your like proficiency in medicine and healing people, you can tell these people aren't acting out of like. Hostility, they're acting out of. They're definitely like sick, and the sickness is causing them to become. Mm hmm. What well, looks like cannibalistic in a sense. Hmm. Alright, Flitz, you're prone and conscious. Uh, he's going to jump up, push himself off, and he's gonna wipe his face, and he's gonna run 15 feet. Okay. Uh, 5, 10, 15. And. Uh, he could still see the dragon? Yeah. Okay. Um, so this is going to be fun. Uh, Flitz is going to use the last two of his sorcery points to bonus action uh, cause uh, the first Yeah, from where set. you're standing, it'd be 80 feet away. Yeah, Eldritch Blast is 120. Yep. He's going to bonus action um, 
quicken spell on the first round of Eldritch Blast. Uh, okay. So, yeah, he's going to do three. It's a bonus action, Eldritch Blast. So that's a dirty 20. That does hit. Okay. Um, I'm just going to roll these all together. Okay. 13 and... 13, yeah, oh, nice. Fuck off. Uh, 13, yeah, not great. Uh, that is uh, 12 damage. Wait, what? I only did 12, only one fucking hit. That's okay. about how it goes. Okay. Um, and because it was a bonus action, I can cast a cantrip as an action. You can. And he's going to go ahead and do another round of Eldritch Blast on it. Nice. Cool. Just Six 23 Blast. to hit. That hits. Fuck. 18 to hit. 18 just misses. Oh, fuck off. What is with me only hitting fucking one of these? Every fucking time. You're hitting um, it, That is 16. That's max. 16. Dragon's looking real damage. bad. God. Damn it. <laughs> uh, that is... Yeah. Uh, oh, I can... Flitz is going to... Because I did the bonus action on my meta magic. He's going to fly up 60 feet to get to this corner here. Of the building. <laughs> okay, sounds good. And land at the corner. Sounds good. All right. Where is number C? Where is the C one? All the way over here. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Dash, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Okay. The one that's prone is going to have to went to stand up. Wherever he got knocked prone at. Or he did. He already moved. Never mind. I forgot he did that. Where is that one? Right here. Hey, Ven. Mm -hmm. The third and final one of this little cluster is going to come in and block you in. There's no more room for them to surround me. They are <laughs> out of spaces. And it's going to go for two claw attacks. Thankfully, you've succeeded on the effect. Yep. Uh, that's a 21 to hit. Yup. For eight slashing damage. Ouch. Second claw attack is a 20 to hit. Yeah, that'll hit. For 10 slashing damage. Men's at 12 hit points. Druck. Uh, bonus action, disengage. Yep. 10. 15. And he'll start just hooping and hollering and just saying, Come get it! Persuasion check. Because <laughs> you can see they've cornered meat that is looking bad. Well, I'm looking bad. Not one. They don't seem interested. Well, I'll make them interested by doing something else. That'd be your action because uh, you did an ability check, I'd say. Well, nah, fuck it. Nah. Yeah, you still got your action and stuff. Uh. Gosh. Druck starts throwing salt on himself. Yeah. Seasoning. Mm. <laughs> little bit of paprika. A little, little spice. And it'll help the sinuses. But Kenna, you're on deck. 15, 20, 25. Okay. Get a little salt bag. <laughs> salt bag. Excuse me. Um. I am going to action dash okay. and then just run into this group of guys and jump on top of them. Just like, whoa, okay. like spread out, like okay. full full condor reach that I have. Okay. I can reach like 10 <laughs> feet and shit. I'm just leaping on top of Onto them. them. Okay, as soon as you touch them, I need you to make a constitution saving throw as their pustules and whatever burst. Yep, yep, yep. I'm doing this on purpose. Constitution saving throw. I can be healed. Uh, so Ben, you watch this drug on all these not. three, and they all—all all the pustules just start bursting, like, <laughs> like all right. gross bubble wrap. Three of them, or just, just one, one for just all one. three? Okay. Oh, I finally rolled well. Nineteen for a twenty-two. Okay, you don't take any poison damage. You don't have—you don't have disadvantage on your next attack roll, ability check, or saving throw. 
Okay. But yeah, well, those things are all just like pop, and then the boils <laughs> regrow. And he goes. <laughs> uh. That was your action. You did the bonus action to yep. disengage. And all my all my movement. Yep. Yeah. All right, Kenna. Uh, uh, can I still see the dragon? Uh, yep. Based on what I did, sorry. Um, where would where would you say I would be at? Based You'd be on there because like, you can't occupy like, you can't you can't occupy any of okay. those four spaces. All right. But uh. thematically, I'm on top of them. Yep. Sure. Or like you know within <laughs> them. Yeah. Okay. Um, is the dragon within 60 feet of me? Uh, no. 75. Oh, bastard. Um, cool. Then, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. I'm actually gonna retreat from the dragon, get around okay. here, see if I can help Ven at all. All right, Coin, you see this, like, wraith-like visage of Kenna just, like, drift back towards you? <laughs> what does Wraith kind of look like? Um. Uh, you guys no legs. Before. They look awful. Oh, no legs. Okay. Yeah, yeah no <laughs> legs. Uh, only gas. Um, or fog. Um, <clears throat> basically, like, the same body type. Um, just a floating head, no skull. Um, but I still have my beard in Wraith form. Still have a ghostly beard. Are you still bold? <laughs> yes. Okay. There might be, like, a little bit growing out, okay, but, like, cool. not enough to see in a ghost form. Um, and then glowing green eyes. You, right. said, you said floating head, no skull. That's cool. so it's just flabby skin. <laughs> there you go. Catch it, air. You said it. It's just flabby skin. Just like... I just wanted to make sure. What, <laughs> or I, are you, that's or is it, or is it, no, or that's is it like, I mean, blown up, like, Kiff's head <laughs> in Futurama? Like, no, no it's just like, got big Nate head going on. It's like it's like, a, it's, like um, it's like Gold Nine Double O Seven when you play uh, Donkey Kong mode. Yeah. Long arms, big heads. Um, no, only skull. Um, okay. No hair. Okay. Um, <laughs> but a beard. But a beard. Nice. I've got my ghostly Very beard nice. going. All right. So what are you um, doing? Uh, so that was thirty feet. Uh, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. I can get on the or the rock. Dragon recharges his breath weapon again. I forgot to roll for it. Um, I'm I'm gonna use my action to get over here and try to. Okay, so this wraith is like Ben. You see this the wraith we described just drift over. Just <gasps> ah, not a, no. <laughs> it's me. You've not seen Kenneth turn into a wraith before. You've seen Kenneth turn into a shadow, and that's it. This is, this I, think, is just, I thought I thought Kenneth turned into a wraith before. Just a shadow so far. I swear we've had this exact conversation before. before. Okay. Anything else? No, I, have I done? No, I, I feel like I've done a wraith before. Um, uh, I don't have any bonus actions, so no, that is my turn. All right. Coin. No, you did when we rescued Coin. Oh, yes, right. Yes, Coin, the dragon what? is yeah. very far from you. It is very far. 95, about 95, 100 feet away from you. Uh, okay. Uh... And your friends are... Yeah, you can see all the infected, like, swarming. You look back and you can see all those infected people swarming on Ven. Druck leap, like, just... Uh, leap onto them. Pop a couple of them. Then I guess it's, uh, just... Mm -hmm. Ah! Uh... It's got to protect the family. It's a family. Uh, oh, this fucker. Mm, this system is... I have, I have yet to get used to it, I'll say that. Because it, it's very delicate. Uh, I guess I'm going to move the 30 feet up on top of this rock and start just hacking away at these things to get them away. Alright. Which one are you attacking? Just You can't ping on this, unfortunately, so just tell me which one. You got 15 foot reach now because you, you did bonus action on this sword. Mm -hmm. The one between uh, uh, Kenna and uh, Ven? The one between Kenna and Ven. Alright, sounds good. Uh, and I have advantage. Are you going lethal on this or no? 
I'm just asking because... Okay. Come on. All right. I mean, I'll swing it around and I'll take damage if I'm just... If you want me just, just to ask, swing the I'm hilt, just asking. The hilt of it instead. What was that? Just uh, just asking. It's up to you. I mean, that's a... That's a yeah, sure. I mean... Okay. I, I guess you have to. Uh... Uh, 29 probably hits, oh, yes? Oh, of course. Great. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do damage on that. That's 16 damage. Uh, okay. How is it looking after getting hit in the head with the hilt? Pretty the hurt. Blade pretty hurt. Cool. Uh, all right, then I'm going to swing at that same one again. Okay. All right. Thirteen hits. Uh, yeah, I mean that was also it was not an advantage, so that was my. Advantage. Oh right, pack tactics. Yep. It was also a natural one, but I still get advantage, oh. so that's twenty-one to hit. Yep. And then six damage, which is uh, eleven. All right, you said you're using the hilt. You're sw you're holding the blade and swing on the hilt around. Yeah. All right. It drops to the ground. Bonus action. Um, uh, I'm gonna get. Uh, I'm gonna use my harness the divine and get a second level spell slot back. All right, sounds good. That bring us to dragon. It's just gonna keep moving, so it's gonna move 40 feet, and then, yep. To more of an, these afflicted people. Which one is going to be attacking? This one's going to attack Kenna, Wraith Kenna. And probably not do anything. So. Okay. Uh, seven to hit. One, that misses. And a 14. That hits. Alright. I think you're just going to resist this. So. Uh, yeah. Seven slashing damage because you're a wraith reduced to three. Mm hmm. Uh, yeah, non magical attack. Yeah, reduced to three. Sweet. Nice. Oh no, I drop out of wraith form. No. No, you don't. <laughs> uh, these ones that were chasing a hot meal over here see their hot meal run away. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. And it's going to get behind Druk. And it's going to go for two attacks. Oh, they get two attacks? Yeah. They've had two they attacks. only attacked once before. They've had two attacks this whole time. They've been doing twice this whole time. They've been okay. doing two claw attacks. Dirty 20 mm -hmm. to hit. Yeah. Uh, seven slashing damage. Okay. And second claw attack. 15 to hit. Uh, misses. All right. Dex. Oh, and at the end of that turn, the dragon's gonna do its wing attack and fly more, so effectively the dragon's out of here. Define out of here. No one can see it or hear it moving anymore. So effectively, um, I should probably not try to follow it, basically. basically. If you want to die, you can follow it, but it's your turn. <laughs> if you want to abandon your friends... That's up to you. I mean, I don't, but I also want to... You're not catching up to the dragon. Yeah. Your turn. Yeah. Oh, boy. What are you doing? Ben, you're on deck. Okay. Um, I can see coin shilling over there. Um. Okay. It hasn't been. It hasn't been a minute since it the has last. Nowhere near been a minute. Yeah. 
So, uh, because it's still up, I can use bonus action again to use um, far step. Mm -hmm. It's still up. Did you make a concentration check when I did its breath weapon? When you were over here? Because you had far step's concentration. I wasn't in that. I it did it did its right. turn and then I All did right, so it. So do what you're gonna do. So then I'll go five, ten, fifty, twenty, twenty, thirty, four, forty, four, five, six, sixty. Okay. Shoop. Uh beans. 30, 35. I'll walk over there. All right, did you, uh, did you dash then? I have 40 feet of movement. Yeah, okay. Okay. Feels like you would have dashed. So somewhere. because it's the bonus action. Oh, right, far step. The far step, yeah. And uh, very much non lethally, the person that is right by me. Very much non-lethally, I I am going to um, just. Do they look okay? They obviously don't look good. Uh, can I hit them with the big sword, but not actually do lethal damage? Just like it's whack complicated because this sword is 150 pounds. The sword is I'm built just... for, like, bringing down structures, so probably not. Uh, then I'm just gonna, like, put, you know, put that down. And I'm just gonna try to knock him out with my fists. Okay, make an unarmed strike. You know. Uh, 14. 14 hits. Uh, so that's 6 damage. Okay, make a constitution saving throw as you pop some of its pustules. Uh, You're fine. 20. And then I'm just gonna punch him again. Okay. Uh, 22. Yep. Six damage again. Alright, another con save. 17. You're fine. Anything else? Okay. No, that's bonus action, action movement. Yep. Ven. Did you add your rage bonus onto those att attacks? Oh, yeah. You no, that. I... So, 3-3. Three, three. Okay, that one's, not, that one's knocked out. Okay. Oh, no, it's got one hit point. Never mind. Ven. Mm. Okay, <laughs> which is the one that has one hit point? The one that Dax is facing. The one south of mm. drug. Oh, that one down there. Okay. Uh, all right. Do I have anything? I don't have anything that attacks multiple. So, um... Yeah, you can I just breathe is... on it hard enough to fall over. Well, it's yeah, it's far farther away from me though. Uh, can Bigby's hand do non-lethal like no. with the with the with the clenched fist part? Because it's like hitting like it's, it's just like smacking them, and it mimics my own hand, so yeah. I can just like flick. Oh, yeah. Not not the crushing. Yeah, but just, it's, like, it's the, hard the to hitting. make magical attacks non-lethal, but sure. Right, because this one mimics my hand Correct. specifically Correct. too, so it's okay. Then I'm gonna cast Bigby's hand, uh, like right next to me. Or right, like, yeah, above these. And then oh. just flick one of them. Righty, give me one second. Alright, Big B's hand. You're dropping a Big B's hand. Sounds good. What color is Ven's Big B's hand? Blue, purple, green, or red? I guess... Let's go with green. It is, like, it is kind of yellow. It's like yellow, but that wasn't an option. Ooh, oh, that, oh it moves? Yeah. What? Oh, that's, that's cool. So cool. Oh, that's so cool. Um, and just be. Eh, no, we might run Wait, into How big is Big okay. It's a, it's large, right? It is. I think it might be huge. Oh, I can't grab it. Well. Uh, no, it's large. It's large. Okay. All right, and then yeah, I'm just gonna flick. So melee spell attack. And you're going against this guy down here. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh, I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna roll the firebolt thing because it's my my spell attack modifier. Sure. Fifteen. Fifteen hits. So just okay. Flex him and he's unconscious. Oh, that one's already okay. Boom. Can I move it? No, it's no, a, it's a part of the map. Unfortunately, I can't. I don't know how to add it uh, as a token. 
Oh, okay. Do you want to move it? Uh, I just want it up kind of like next to me, but yeah, it doesn't really matter. No, oh, I was flicking the one. I was flicking one of the ones next to me, not that one. Oh. Uh, yeah. Well. Can I? I mean, that one had one hit point. Now it's. Uh, he. Fuck. Well, I can't bring his token back. That's fun. So he uh, he collapses. Okay. All right. So um. I mean, if, so if which, I take which, one of these, which one against which one are against uh, near you? Uh, you the one on the left. Uh, all right. So yeah, that so, hits. Okay, so it does twenty-three force damage. Wow, it's also out. Okay, so I suppose if you wanted to keep that other one down, you could just move that token down to where the other one was. That makes sense. All right, and you want your baby's pan to be near you? Yeah, like in the two, like above the rock tail, basically just due south of me and coin. Yeah. All right, cool. Anything else? Uh, no, that'll be it. Alright, Flitz. Okay, um... So I know... I will say this, I know Dax was limited, because Dax had to get up and personal. Yeah. But Flitz has range. Yeah, the dragon at this point would be... It moves 70 feet on a turn, and it's moved three turns since you last attacked it. Or it's moved three times since you last attacked it, so it did legendary actions to move. So oh, it's, yeah, it's, so it doesn't it's, move. It's effectively like out of here. Times three, yeah, okay. Yeah. Cool. Alright, uh Flex is gonna stare angrily off into the distance for a second and turn heat wheel and run to this corner of the building. Okay. And seeing three remaining? Yep. You can see all three. You can see you can there's four of them, but you can see three of them. Oh, there is four? Yeah. You can't see the four <gasps> of them. Oh. Well, Okay. Um, cool. He is going to uh, do a. <sighs> Are they all looking pretty bad? Uh, yeah, effectively. Okay. He is going to. He's going to do a second level. He's going to do a first level magic missile. All right. But he's throwing dice. these. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, forget. oh fuck. Oh, that's it. Yep, there it okay, is. So magic missile, still, magic missile still goes off. So do that first. Uh -huh. Okay. So he's doing one dart at each of them. Okay. Cool. Directing the dart to hit them in a non-lethal place. Okay. So it's gut. Sounds good. Or leg. Sounds good. Um. So with that damage, yeah, it's uh three damage each. Alrighty. Okay. One, co one collapses. The... Okay. Alright. And then yeah, we'll roll the D100. Uh oh. That's 20. You cast Grease centered on yourself. So as you do this, this pool of Grease <laughs> in a 10 foot Not square on the corner boss. of this roof, uh, I need you to make a dexterity saving throw equal to your spell save DC. Yet. Uh, great. <laughs> Oof. Uh, nope. <laughs> I fall. <laughs> okay, so you fall off the roof and land prone, <laughs> on, land prone on the ground and you take 7 bludgeoning damage. Just <laughs> Oof. He's gonna get up. Yeah. And he's gonna, like, oh shit. Uh, he's, he's, this has never happened before, and he's never used this spell before. So he doesn't really know what happened, so he's gonna take a step. Uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure with Grease, it's like, is it a, is it a one time thing? Or is that it ends the area or it? ends its turn there? You've already okay. entered, entered the area because it spawned on top of you. Got it. Okay. So, yeah, you're, you're good. Uh, as long so... as you leave the Grease, you're good. Hill 15 feet to okay, get you're out up of the here. Grease. The grease is just dripping off the corner of the building and on the, f the ground under it. Oh, man. Okay. That's it? Uh, yeah, that's going to be it. Okay. Oh, 
Alright. Alrighty. Dax, you see one of these things come up from the south, up to you. And two melee attacks. Uh, t dirty 20 to hit? Yep. Okay. Uh, five slashing damage reduced to two. Cool beans. Uh, 23 to hit. Yep. Uh, I need you to make a const uh, constitution saving throw for the first one. And then six reduced to three for the second. Oh, wait, you've already succeeded on this. Never mind. All right. And that's going to bring us to the one that's pincering Druck and Ven. Druck leaped on it, so it's going to turn around and attack Druck. So. Uh, 11 to hit. Miss. And 8 to hit. Miss. Cool. So you land on it. We'll say you're like on its back or whatever, and it's like <laughs> trying to like swat at you. I don't know. Druck, it's your turn though. Uh, Druck's going to... Grab the one that's near Ven that just attacked okay, him. Okay, I need you to make another con save as you touch it. Yep, and he's just gonna try grappling it. Okay. Um, that's a two. All right, so you take three poison damage, and you have disadvantage on your next attack roll ability check or saving throw. Okay, so but gonna... that's but that's before that's so I'm gonna make my grapple before that though, correct? No, nope. because Cause this, the condition, the condition I, gets applied the... as you touch it. Right, but that is the grapple, isn't it? All right, it? fine, whatever, sure. That is the attack. I'm sure, like whatever. Grappling yep, it, sure. touching it, right? Sure. So acrobatics or athletics? Uh, I mean, I, I believe I, I have, I'm forced to use athletics. Right, and you are, yep, that's right. And you have disadvantage because of, uh, don't you? Because right, of, uh, thank exhaustion. you. Yep. So ten. Uh, you beat it. You beat its eight. Woo. So I'm grappling that one. Yep. He says, Van! Anyone! Can we help these people? Alright. Kind of. Uh, and then... Oh, sorry, yeah. Uh, I'm just checking. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't have any bonus actions. I can't move with this guy while grappling him, so yeah, that's it. Alright, kind of. Uh, how's the one that's kind of pins, uh, pinned between me, Ven, and Druck looking? Oh, that's the one Druck's grappling. Uh, that one's looking real bad. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna try to knock down hit points with the one that's on the opposite side of me. Okay, just so you know, the Wraith uh, can't do non-lethal damage. I know, but it also... Because oh, you're draining people's like vitality, 40. you can't do that yeah. non-lethally. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Cool. Uh, then I, You're I'm just gonna hold. Literally draining their life force. Just. Yeah. Yeah. Um. I. I don't want to drop my wild shape in case the dragon comes back. Because it's really helpful for the dragon, but. He's a big coward, or she's a big coward. Um. So I'm just going to hold my action until uh, one of them attack. I can't, I can't give anyone cover because I'm incorporeal. So Correct. I'm just going to hold a, an attack action for if okay. either of two. Okay. So uh, you do know, just so you're aware, the life drain is... Yeah. You can't do it non-lethally. Okay. Coin. I think you're muted. Oh, I know. I needed to find the screen. Uh, great. Uh, coin is going to uh, move in between uh, these two friends here. Um, and I'm going to lay on hands the uh, one that's in front of okay. me. Okay. You cure the disease that's afflicting them, and all the pustules and boils go away, and they're like, ah! They feel like drug, like on them. They're like, "What's going on?" And that's, that's again, can't have a huge conversation in combat. But yeah, you you cure that person. 
So they're effectively cured. They're no longer a threat. And that's the one I have grappled. Yeah, the correct. one you're holding on to. Cool. The point just cured it. Them. Him. Sorry. Great. And then I'm going to gain another spell slot back. Okay. That's your turn? Yep. Alright. Dragon's going to be doing what it's doing. And you guys get the fuck out of here out of dodge. Uh, it's going to bring us to the infected person that's behind Wraith Kenna, and it's just going to attack Wraith Kenna, which means your attack would go, your held a action would go off. Uh, does a 10 hit? <laughs> yep. Oh. But it's, its attack gets resolved first. Uh, yeah. So 17 to hit. Uh, yeah, that hits. So... Six slashing damage reduced to three. You're still very much okay. a wraith. And then life yeah. drain on this person. Alright. Uh, let me pull up the thing. Uh, is 48 plus three. Well, roll, the hit, roll the hit first. Uh, oh, you I did hit. You did. That's right. Hit. You did hit. Yeah. Please roll low. Oh, that's two sevens. Gross. Um, 14, 20, that's 23 total. And they need to make a constitution saving throw? Yes. Alright, because that'll reduce their maximum hit points. Yeah. Their maximum hit points are reduced to zero. So you just drain them of their life force, and they just oh, fall to the like... You oh. full on drain them, and they fall to the ground. Ooh. They have twenty two max. They have twenty two max hit points, so they fall to the ground, just a withered husk. Oh. I feel real bad about and that one. You, uh, you, you uh, consume that life force. It doesn't heal you or anything, but you do. You nope. drain it and consume it. Uh, yeah, that that that's a dead. That was a bad that's man. That's a consumed person. Yeah. Well. God, yeah, I... Nah. We should start questioning Kenna's transformations regarding this. Anyways, anything... That, oh, that was a held action. Sorry, that's not your turn. Um... No. <laughs> that's fun. Okay. Alright. Dax. The one that is closest to Druk is the one with one hit point, correct? Yes. Okay, the one and the one in, directly in front of you has not been hit. You don't know. Okay, okay, from what I don't know. Okay. Um, yeah, that one hasn't been hit yet. Okay, so... And you watch the coin just instantly heal one. Yeah, so we're just fucking around with our fists again. And we're just gonna go boom the one right in front of me again. Alright, make an unarmed strike. 21. That hits, it has one hit point, so it drops. I need you to make a constitution boom. saving throw, though. As you hit it, you take five poison damage, though. Oh, right, no, hold on. Constitution save first, then you'll see if you take the damage. 13. You succeed, so no poison damage. And that one is knocked unconscious. Okay, and then the one that's directly in front of me. Behind you. Yeah, directly behind me so like I I throw like a right hook to that one and then I spin and go with the left hook on that one alright 17 hits so boom 6 point a, damage plus 3 oh plus 3 9 yep alright constitution saving throw mm -hmm. just keep popping these blisters 18 you're fine anything else probably not Nope. Ven. Uh, uh, bonus action, flick. Wait, is there even one left up? Left up? Uh, one behind Dax. Okay. And the dude that Druk is grappling got cured and is back to being humanoid. Right. So then fly over. Uh, so bonus action, fly over and flick the one next to Dax. All right, go for it. Uh, never mind. It's a nat one. All right. Cool. Um, and then I'm gonna 
5, 10, 15, 20, 30. Move over to here and uh, go up to the one that Kenna just killed. Yep. Um, I'm sorry. I didn't did the, want to. Did the drain, did the drain you like... You cannot restore a creature back to life that's had its hit point maximum reduced to zero because you, there's nothing to... It has no hit point maximum anymore. Yeah. Uh, yeah, re resurrection spells don't work on that. Only true resurrection does. Enough. I'm sorry. As I per didn't... a ruling that makes sense, that I saw. So, because yeah, you can't restore. You can only restore hit point. You can only restore uh, yeah. that stuff with greater restoration. You can't cast greater restoration on a corpse. Mm. Yeah. So there's no hit points to give that thing. It has zero hit points total. Would re uh oh what would it nope. be? Nope. True resurrection is the only thing that'll do. Not resurrection. Um, reincarnate because it would technically have a different body. Uh. Reincarnate, I ask that you get consent of the people you bring back to life. Because you're technically you're changing somebody's yeah. lineage and gender, possibly, so. I mean, it's your NPC. Up, just a you're the one up. to give consent, Justin. It's your <laughs> NPC. Yeah. Just saying. Yeah. Speak with the. Also, That's true. Yeah. So, yeah. But yeah, that person's a husk. So, Ven, what are you doing? Ven just wastes his action just, like, looking over the husk and despairing yeah. at the fact that he can't rescue this person, despite the fact that we just saw that we can save them and kind of killed this person for no reason. Yep. All right, cool. Uh, uh, yeah, I will... If right. I can, I will solely be responsible all for right. their resurrection. Flitz tumble pots. Um... Oh, gosh. Uh... Dragon's still in the back of his mind, but he's going to see the last one standing... Um, he's gonna do a first level magic missile. Just at parts that aren't. Yeah, it's okay. more like he's hoping just to get some like gut punches, boop, 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 okay. like you know, just okay. Hoping for the best here. Oh god, um, that's all three there. That's fifteen. They also drop. Um. Also, let me roll my percentile dice. Oh yes, thank you. <laughs> 77. Aw. All right. That ends the combat encounter. Man. Yeah, if, if you would have gotten that fireball on self, like, all of those people would just oh. be dead. Uh, <laughs> I don't think anybody's around us. No, because would be fine. I, I would be far, dead. Oh, you are. I, you would are yeah, yeah, <laughs> I would be dead. I would be the dead one. Yeah, Flitz is far enough away. All right. Flitz is going to shuffle over. But you're... That's combat. Did, you guys, did that switch you guys to a different map? Uh, the music's still going. Yeah, I can't stop that. I have to manually stop that. All right, okay. did you all get switched over though? Oh, there yes. Yep. All right, yeah. So the two that are the ones that are unconscious, they're unconscious. There's one who's a dried out husk. The one who's healed is like, uh, uh, are you still grappling the one who you healed? Uh, I mean, I'll hear them breathing and say they. I mean, they said what they said. You no, know, flip them around. What do you remember? Don't touch me and runs away from you and like gets behind close to somebody else. You... I still have him grappled. He has oh, zero movement. Okay, he's gonna try to break out. He's gonna try to hit you because he does not want to be grappled by you. Sure. Uh, there's a natural 20 hit. <laughs> you take two bludgeoning damage as he clocks you in the forehead. <laughs> let hey, me go. Druck, he, he, Druck. Got, he got clawed. He's infected. Tell him to let me go. Druck, let him go. Yeah. All right. uh, and then just scurries, was... runs, runs away from you and gets as close to coin as possible. He's infected. Infected, infected, infected. You got clawed. You're infected. And you guys can start to see boils starting to like grow out of the cut on Druck's uh, skin. Oh. Uh, co coin? Coin? Yeah, no, I'm going to go up to Coin and just kind of look at the dude. Looking at, him, looking at the dude the whole time and just lay on hands. Uh, Alright, Druck is cured him. by the disease. By, by that. Uh, I'm going to go around and walk around to every unconscious person five okay. at a time and cure them and put whatever health points into them. Okay. Who's here out on the field that's not a husk? Yeah, how many so yes. that he can get a tally uh, of the be, points? Uh, there were six of them total, so you can, it's five. That are Four left, that can be uh, fixed. Five right. times five? So, yeah, five times or, four. Yeah. Oh, six yeah. Times, so I got it. Plus Druck, if you're doing it to Druck. Yeah, so. so then 25, so yeah. yeah. And did you, did, you, yeah. did you mark that on the guy who you healed before? Okay, cool. Yeah, so everyone that can, <sighs> everyone that can be healed is healed, uh, aside from the 
And then there's just the husk laying on the ground. Corn, I didn't know you could do that. I mean, first of all, uh, through Bahamut, anything is possible, so go ahead and write that down. <laughs> oh shit, I forgot something. Oh, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> the, dragon, the dragon's alive. Okay. Uh, so as, as coin as you <laughs> Anything is possible. Uh, I suppose so. Yeah, coin. As you, uh, <sighs> as you, as you start curing, as you start, as you start curing, as you start curing uh, the disease on these people, they're still unconscious, but then they pop up. Uh, we're gonna go to break. So and then we'll be back in ten minutes. So to pick up in the middle of this abandoned, infested town. Yay!
Dragon fled after getting absolutely fucking whatever, and uh, 
left leaving you all to deal with the infected people. Coin healed most of them. Cured all but one. Uh, well, all the other the final one was reduced to a necrotic husk. Uh, and we're gonna pick up in the middle of this uh, town. The buildings are all still boarded up. One of the buildings had its wall completely just taken down. Uh, the dead rock in the middle of the town that's nearly beheaded. Uh, and the people that are cured are slowly stirring and getting up and what have you. Uh, I'm gonna drop out of wild shape Good and idea. cast locate creature on the dragon. Is there a casting time on that? Uh, I believe it's one action. Mm -hmm. Alright, what's the range on that? Uh, up to a thousand feet. It is far out of a thousand feet. Okay. It's, Even it's within like a minute? It's continuously moving while Coin was healing and all this stuff was happening. So that's yeah, the wind. Oh, yeah, so it's just like, yeah. uh, land. <laughs> land. It gets the bird burst from its fly <laughs> just... for a little bit. It flies, like, it flies uh, 80 feet and then lands, runs, flies 80 feet, lands every six seconds. It's gone. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Oh, it has an 80 foot move speed? Okay. Uh, and coin, as you're doing this, you can feel the fragment of your orb get warm and it pings in a direction. Northwest. While everybody's distracted, Flitz is going to try to pull out a feather from the rock. Okay, you can. It's pretty big. It's a pretty big feather. It's probably the size of your arm. In length. We should not waste this. And as you're looking at it, Flitz, you can see little beads of like corruption, like the people have slowly begun to like spread through its flesh and organs. Like whatever this thing is, it also was corrupted and tainted. Is the rock still alive or no? No, it's dead like, as fully fuck. Dead. Okay. Yeah, I was about to throw a catapult something at its skull. Um, Alright, it's a pretty big fucking feather. He'll start collecting a handful of them. He'll just start collecting, plucking them out. They got a chest they can put this in. Okay. The only <laughs> thing that's really not tainted on this thing are the feathers. Yeah, he's going for like... It's much of a... He's, like, right, collecting cool. little piles. I guess we're going to pull up my uh, harvesting table mechanics that I have here. Flitz. Would you like some help? I have uh, some experience. Because this uh, is a rock, making, it's going to have a high DC. Crossbows. Sure. Right. Feathers. I, Come on. Let's yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. All right. Because, you seem a little untrained right. in this. Because nah. this creature is a monstrosity, the player <laughs> rolls... Because this creature is a monstrosity, the player rolls a nature check. So, looking for feathers... Yeah, yeah. He'll assist Druk. Right. Now that he's uh, Druk, Druk nature check with advantage. Uh, this is an ability check, so it's a straight roll. Because I'm exhausted. Correct. So just a straight roll. That's a twenty-nine. Twenty-nine. You fill five large pouches. You have five large pouches to fill rock feathers with. That's how many you get. Five large yeah. pouches. Yeah. Each feather weighs three pounds. Mark it off, Flitz. <laughs> <laughs> get on it man I'm not breaking this down this oh, is yeah. your feathers sorry sorry, 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 sorry. It's, <laughs> it's, it's three pounds worth of feathers so you get five oh, large okay. pouches worth of feathers so that's a lot of feathers 15 pounds worth of feathers and most rocks have a, are, have feathers of a variety of colors this one is just jet black like a massive raven almost uh, that's so cool uh, the feathers appear that to be too, cool. the feathers appear to be too large for common crafting uh However, it looks like with some expert precision, the soft bristles of the feathers can be removed and used in most items. However, uh, the three pounds of rock feathers you have gathered are worth 30 gold pieces if you choose to sell them to someone. Queen, can I borrow your um, your chest? Your big box? Oh, yeah. wait, I don't need to do that. One second. Um, <laughs> he's going to clap his hands and his, his uh, the mouth of his bottle is going to open. He's just going to He'll take some like twine and like kind of bundle. Keep keep you basically it in bundles. Have the, the basically Wait. you're making like a, it's basically it looks like a bedroll in terms of its <gasps> size. Wait. Made of feathers. Can I have five of those. Fritz, did I just work this hard so that you could have a comfier pillow? I'm not going to say no. <laughs> I'm not 
I'm going to say yes. It looks yes like it would make some really good, like, stuffing for a pillow. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Thank you. I'll take the last one and I'll cork it. <laughs> Flitz, visually, because <laughs> Flitz fucking died. <laughs> Um, he well, took some major damage. Uh, well, yeah, he took some major fucking damage with those. But he is like, his eyes are like, you know, a little uh, yellowish. Like, Ew. his skin is a little uh, nasty looking. Uh, Gross. Yeah, he yeah, he inhaled ninety something points of damage yeah. of poison. Because he didn't save once, yeah. and so it was like forty for the first and fifty for the second. So it's like almost a hundred points of damage. Uh, uh, okay. So he looks rough. Uh, coin. While that that's happening, you feel the orb get warm again, and it pings again northwest. And you haven't you haven't felt this ping before, so this is new. Hey. It feels like a little like <sighs> vibration through your uh, hands. If you're holding it, I don't imagine you're not holding it, but you can just feel like it pinging on your body wherever you have it. That's a good vibration. Like a pager going off. No, like the like right. the like the tracker in Alien. Like boop boop. boop, boop. All right. So it seems this thing got away. Uh, how do we? It went that way. What way? Uh, he's just gonna point in the general west direction that he was initially traveling. That that flitz was we, running toward. What do we know about this? It seems like we perhaps we can set a trap or something, anything, right? We need to. Do we have anything to keep it nailed down? Or? Do you can see the people that were here have just kind of like wandered off to like gather their belongings. Well, maybe we should take care of them first. Maybe we should get them to they, the city. Honestly, they will take care of themselves. There's a there's a city close by. As long as they stick to the road, they should be fine. Is there? What city? There's a town. Look on the map. One town. Second. It's it's uh, within a day's the, travel. The closest town from here is Corvanis, which is two days and five hours, fifty oh, miles days. away. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. far. I mean, what if we just want? Aren't we going that way? We have to go up to the the, the Argent city, uh, town, which is. I mean, I, if, way, right? if I'm being honest, I. Uh, Correct me if I should probably make a survival check on this, uh, Flitz. It seems like this, uh, this bounty was actually on this rock. This you don't dead, know. gigantic bird. It could have been on this rock, and or the, the dragon. dragon. Regardless, there isn't much of a reason to go that far north. Wait. Should we take something else then? Because what if they ask for my feathers? What do you mean? You cannot carry like the head around. I'll just proof. say the head's way too big to carry. Like, what if we take the beak off? <laughs> uh, what's coin doing? What's, what's, I mean, what's coin doing? During I mean, all this? they have very good eyes. You could just try to harvest an eye from it and put it in the, my my uh, bag of cold. Is Coin not doing anything? I, I couldn't hear a response. Okay. And nothing, nothing really to report. Okay. All right. So it got away. What, what now? How? How can we stop it? Can we get um, inside? How can we? Can we what? like go inside? It's very loud. It's raining. This is miserable. Very miserable. Can we like go stand inside a building? There's the building. I... That had the, there's the building that had the wall. Yeah. Collapse. All the other Preferably buildings. Preferably one with all the, the, all the other buildings. You can, hear, you can hear people like locking the people that like are cured. They're like locking their doors. Staying here. Wait, so they could get into their their houses that had locked doors? Or like? Oh right, no, they can't. Doors? They broke through all the windows and they opened the doors. But they the doors that were open from the inside. Uh, but they can too, right? I mean, so they came out of doors, so they can sorry, go back. They're in crawling through broken windows to get back into their house. Yeah. Gather, gather belongings. Regardless, it looks like they're abandoning the town because there's like nothing here. 
Are there any other, uh, is there any other semi-life in town? Uh, no. As for commerce, you don't see any, like, general stores or anything or inns or taverns in this town. Are there any animals around? Uh, there's, like, small animals that are still... Uh, actually, Coin, make a perception check. With disadvantage because of the rain. Two. Two. Uh, you don't really see anything. Probably scared off in the skirmish. Aren't they under its thrall? Yeah, but once it was fighting, probably not. Alright, so let's see if we can't take this thing's eyes. They look astute. And they're pretty, they're also kind of like uh, corrupted a little bit. Just go for the beak. Yes, that does seem less... It also has talons. It is a oh. bird. <laughs> yes, big feet. Let, uh, all or right, let's... Feet. Let's, uh, how about... You, you would not be able to carry do... a whole foot around. Right, let's, uh... Let's, a talon. Uh, the talons are several feet long as well. We'll do an appraisal. We'll do an appraisal. Jesus. And I'll just look at the whole thing. See what can be harvested, and okay, then make a survival check. try to harvest. Oh, okay. Straight survival check. Or okay. just a survival check. Whatever. I don't know how you do it anymore. 20. 20? Uh, the eyes, probably not. The feathers. The beak, perhaps. And the talons. Everything All else right. that's made of, like, fleshy organic material and blood? No. All right. We'll take what we can. All right. Uh, it's a DC. It's a check for each one. So, what are you taking? All of it. So, talons and beak. You already yeah. got the feathers. So, okay. So, it's separate check for the talons. So, nature check for the talons. Nature for this check. one on my harvesting table, DC twenty five. Ooh, natural twenty. For a thirty two. <laughs> okay. You get six talons. Each one weighs twenty five pounds. Oh, I get all all, all six. six. You get six talons, or I guess all it, all six. No, no, because there's four. You get all six. Or there's four you each. Get, you get all six. Right. Okay. It's on the table it says six. So all you get six right. talons. You got goofy feet. Twenty five pounds total, for, or twenty five pounds for each talon. It's gnarly. And for all the talons, you don't know how much they're worth, but you got six rocks talent. Six, Sorry. Six rock six rock talons, twenty five pounds each. Hold on. Let me let me put that down here first. Uh, talent, comma, rock. Oh shit! I, uh, Roc. Uh, I custom. Sorry. Fuck. I hate how it does this. Uh, What's everybody else doing? Um, Go ahead. Sorry. Uh, I'm said... just kneeling and staring at the corpse that I made. Yeah, they're starting to like liquefy from the corruption? Um... Like, they're turning into a puddle. Uh, I'm... Could I have cast detect... Um... Uh... Sorry, words are hard. Uh, greater... Uh, gentle repose uh, after I, um... got into... Yeah, still liquefying. A drop ball shape. Uh, it prevents decay. It's not decay. For ten days. Well, body's not decaying, it's just liquefying. But it does say it prevents the effects of it, right? Like that yeah, for the duration, your target is protected from decay and can't become undead it's not decay, for 10 days. It's not decay. That's it's so bizarre. Why? How is, how is that not decaying? It's still just as vital. It's just vital goo. Yeah, it's just not work. It's just not solid. It's just turning to liquid. This session of D and D is brought to you by Vital Glue. Missing vim and vigor? Reach oh. for a bottle of Vital Goo. Well, the important part of that spell is the spell also effectively extends the time limit on yeah. raising the target yeah. from the dead. So you're good. But also, I'm just saying, it's goo. Yeah, whatever. 
It's fine. I think it's I think people. based on the reduction to and also you're not bringing this thing back because none of you have the capabilities to do so. Yeah, yeah. I I don't have the spell. I don't have reincarnate prepared also, today. Also, they have to consent to you turning them into a different race. Mm -hmm. I mean, if I had it prepared, I would have cast speak with dead and asked if they consented. But let's mold earth to dig out a little spot next to the goo. Okay. The goo would start to, like... Out. How close are you doing it to? Like, right up against it, or...? No, he'll do it. If he'll let Kenna, seeing Kenna have their moment, he'll let... Yeah. He'll do it just enough away that Kenna can kind of just scoop a little bit of the earth from underneath it and... Like, create a little into... trench. Yeah. Yeah, uh, each of those yeah. talons is 25 pounds. Yeah, I'm gonna start Ooh, doing thank that. thank you. Um, just 25, real solemnly. 25. And then we got six of them? Yep. It's a total of 150 pounds. Okay, cool. And those will not fit in the chest of preserving. There are several um, people. But also they don't decay. They're talons. And then if I could, I'm going to do my best to recite one of Coin's prayers of Bahamut as I'm like digging out this little trench. Okay. As you do so, the goo bubbles. All right, who's playing Jackie Wilson? Like violent Can... bubbles, like Ivan Ooze, just like. Blitz is gonna start repeating the words, but a draconic. Bubbles violently, more violent. Just... Uh. D detect magic. Okay. Uh, you detect divination. I'm going to I'm going to quickly start um oh, divination magic on oh, I I feel like the dragon is doing this and then it stops bubbling cuz everyone stopped talking like rotating the prayer so just unless Flitz is still doing it oh no cuz it kind of would have stopped so yeah it goes back yeah, to just I, being yeah I I stopped um immobile. when I saw it get more violent yeah, it goes back to being immobile goo. I don't think I was supposed to do that to you. I've never seen anything turn to goo before, much less bubble. It's carbonated. I've seen, I've seen some things melt down into nothingness before. I think you're muted, Caleb. I'd like to cast Divine Sense. Okay, uh, what does that detect? Um, you can see and sense anything uh, affected by the hallow spell or know the location of any celestial fiend or undead within 60 feet that is not behind cover. Okay. Mm. You don't well, maybe, that's not, maybe that's not useful at all. Yeah, you, 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 yeah. you pop divine sense and you don't detect anything. The hallow spell also includes fey, I believe. So. It's it like say. a weird thing. No, but I mean like it refers to the hallow spell. Anyway, regardless. Should I, can I, should I put the earth back? I um, mean, either way, he, they deserve proper burial. Uh, Bury the goo. Going to shift. It's better than nothing. It's shift the And it is raining, around. so the goo is kind of like, uh, yeah. it actually isn't getting dispersed by the rain. It's just still staying in the exact spot. And the it's water, the water seems buried. like when the water hits it, the water just kind of runs off of it and doesn't seem to affect it. Kind of. I don't speak for others, just myself, but that form you take, uh, it is unsettling and perhaps not for the best considering what it does. You might be right about that. But, uh, I'll admit this, uh, this was entirely my fault, not the form I took. I made a choice to retaliate. That's on me. I didn't have to, but I did. Because I thought it would you... be protecting y'all, but... Wait, but did you know that 
that form you take would do is such what it did. It had never been successful before. So I didn't think it would be capable of this. But you knew what it was capable of, or not. Subconsciously, I guess, yeah. We need to find more drugs for this conversation. I think. Drug. You know just what to say. Every time. Let's go find some fucking drugs. <laughs> he throws up a hand. He throws up a hand like this. Just it's like, like it's like class. it's like gooshing rain and it's so windy. Up, and he's just like whoosh. <laughs> oh no no no. Coin, what's up? Oh, I thought you said something. Uh, I was going to. Oh, okay. Uh, let us uh, gather around and uh, you may join me in a hymn. Coin has got putting okay. it in the ground. I'll get drugs after this, truck. Do we hold hands or do we just sit no, here no. and meditate? So, or? So, said your love lifting me higher than I've ever been lifted before keep it up lifting me higher and I am at your side forevermore and it continues to sing uh, your love keeps lifting me higher and higher by Jackie Wilson Okay. <laughs> hopefully that does not give us a copyright strike but uh alright <laughs> I mean, you right. play you played copyright music. I know. We'll see, we'll see what happens. So it's happens. already tanked if it already. Is. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Yeah. Um, it's worth doing. It's worth overdoing. Uh, all right. So you do that. Um, the goo doesn't bubble from that. Uh, it just oh, stays, really? It just stays really? Because <laughs> it's it's not a, it's not it's not referencing Bahamut at all. It's just a. I thought that would have been perfect. <laughs> Okay, okay. Fine. okay, fine. The goo <laughs> violently bubbles and starts right. to, and starts to like look like it's starting to animate Is in, it? into a humanoid shape. Sorry, Jesley, it was a Ghostbusters reference. Then I'm going to keep. Yeah, it's from Ghostbusters too. Yeah. Uh, but then, yes, yeah, keep bubbling. keep singing it. It's a three minute song, so I guess. Okay, you keep singing it. Uh, thirty goo, actions. Of, goo, thirty <laughs> actions worth of song. The goo. Uh, okay. 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 The goo. <laughs> forms into a doorway. A spherical doorway that's rippling. I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna lean over to point. No, I'm no I look at I look at Kenna. I mean there is di divination magic on it. And you all hear a voice that says Ah interesting. And it sounds like five heads speaking at once, like five voices at once. Yeah, it's certainly a spit on the ground. <laughs> and then you hear, uh, who all knows Dachronic? Wait, so who all knows I detected yeah. good and evil, yeah. and then it didn't pop off. But you kept doing it, so then it formed into something. It, okay. wouldn't, have, it wouldn't have popped off until this was fully formed. Okay. I think it's me, then and... Okay, you Another hear corner? the voice say, It's vulnerable. And then the door closes. It's vulnerable. What does that mean? Goo doorway. It said something was uh, vulnerable. I don't know what that means. Does it mean the the dragon that we just fought? It, what just spoke? Does anybody know what just spoke? Coin, you have, mm. you're 100% certain it was Tiamat. Trash dragon whose name we dare not speak. <laughs> <laughs> that one. 
Uh, uh, what did you say? What did, I mean, you said that it was. It said. It said exactly what I said. It's, it's said, vulnerable. It's vulnerable. I mean, what would it be referring to? Dax did wallop that green dragon quite a bit. I Perhaps felt like were... I was out of my brain last time, wasn't really here, and I did that and that. This thing is incredible. And yeah, coin, the, the fragment you have just pings again, just ping. Perhaps we've tapped into some sort of connection between Trash Dragon Supreme <coughs> and uh, that green one. Is that... Does that seem... The, the headband of intellect is going nuts right now on <laughs> Druck's head, and he's just like going, boop, 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 boop. All of this sounds like, oh, yes, this all seems connected. <laughs> I've connected the dogs. I have, you haven't connected shit. I've connected them. I <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that is, uh, I mean, I'd have to ask Ken if that is a byproduct of Vital Boo. Uh, Flitz, this spell, that emanated a similar aura of magic that you use when you talk through your, when you, when you talk through your little necklace. You know, uh... You know how you get uh, your capabilities and such, you know. Bahamut gives it to you, coin. You know, as you feel. He blesses you with uh, divine yeah, Well, yes, I am, merely an, yeah, I am merely an instrument of Bahamut, too, which is great. Works are, you know, manifest uh, in the physical plane. But yes, uh, essentially what you said, yes. Yes, yes. Um, so... On the rare occurrence, things happen. I can speak out to uh, someone, the, the, the entity that uh, gave me some of my gifts. What just happened there is a very similar uh, situation. I think maybe there's a invisible tether that attaches or is attached to the green dragon and your trash dragon and residual effects from the green dragon will consistently uh, be able to connect to uh, maybe whatever uh, this plague that it seems to, uh, maybe it influences on that. Maybe it's a direct line from the green. You know, everything that I do through myself has residual, uh, uh, residual effects of my entity as well, of, of who gives me my abilities, you know, as a, so maybe that's something akin to that. I don't so you're know. you're saying the vital goo will forever be connected to this green dragon who is forever connected to uh TM. yes I think uh, but I don't know what I don't know why it seems the runes might be important did anyone get a good look at them perhaps they could be deciphered into something that could give us more information uh, Sam I sent you a message on discord No, I was too busy every time. And I who now? It's too busy taking poison to the face to um. get a good look. I never. Okay, this whole battle, I never even saw the dragon. Just so all of you know, never even saw it. Might not even oh. exist. It does have the capability of turning itself invisible, which I stopped. Yeah, I, I saw. Oh. Yeah. Well, I didn't <laughs> see you cast it because I think you were invisible at the I time. Was. But like, I saw him like briefly like shimmer out of existence and then like come back. Was that you? Mm -hmm. Forgot to mention yeah. uh, when you fought the red dragon, the glyphs under his eyes would fade once he cast a spell. 
Same thing for the green dragon. The rune slash glyphs under the eyes, same thing. So do they fade one at a time, or just like all of them once? Uh, no, one at a time when I cast a spell, depending on the spell oh, okay. casts. I'm going to walk over to Flitz and cast a fifth level Cure Wounds. Okay. Flitz is kind of like bleeding from the eyes a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 27 hit points. Um, uh, are you poisoned, Flitz? No. Okay. All right. Everyone, I, uh, I think it's uh, my turn to uh, bring the bad news. But if you pursue this dragon, I will not be able to come with you. I cannot move fast enough. We cannot chase this thing down in my condition. If I were to stay with you, you would have to leave me behind. Just get on the carpet. Yeah. What? What? Yeah. We have a carpet that can... We literally have yeah. seen it. Drug, you, carry me. You, you wrote on it. <laughs> For a little bit. <laughs> I... <laughs> It will yeah, carry you'll be you able along. To stay ahead, but you can keep up with us at least until we mm -hmm. rest. I honestly should have used that during that fight to get over the house, but whatever. Then it's new. I forgot about it. Do you mind if I use it right now? Uh, we can both use it. Cool. So, do we want to? Can I get on it as well? Uh, there should be room. Yes. And while we're traveling along, can I just kind of like? Take a little snooze. Depends on how long we're traveling for. That's very true, yes. Hmm. Do we can, want to chase it? Can we get rest in the middle of heavy, without shelter, in the middle of heavy rain and wind? Uh, you can, but it might not be great. Well, Flitz can in the bottle. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> also, also, got... Ven, also, 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 Ven could also just throw the tower up. Is All right. Tower once a day? But not not no, while we're moving. Yeah. yeah. No, not when yeah. you're moving. I, is that I, a, sorry, is that a spell, Ven? The or tower? It... No, it's a magic item. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> it's, a, it's an adamantine tower that we can just go boop and it just like appears. We love, but, love that. Oh. I should let all of you know I am quite exhausted. <laughs> though. Yeah, if uh, we could take at least a short rest. That will not yeah, help. It has me. been enough, not, not enough time has passed to do a long rest. Nowhere near. I'm just saying, you know, I. Uh, no matter what happens, I will be uh, ineffective. Uh, no, you're going oh, wait, to always coin, be. You did lay on hands on Druck, right? Does that cure poison? Yes. Okay, so Druk, your your one exhaustion level will be gone, so you'd be back at one. Oh. Because you got cured from the disease that was afflicting you, giving you the second level. Wow, Druk, yeah, you straight up alive to us. Uh, if you just wanted to ride the carpet, disease. all you had to do was say it. Yeah. So yeah. Oh, I'm I'm really tired, guys. I'm serious. <laughs> and he like curls up, typical bugbear fashion, just rolls up into a ball, and just starts to nap because. This guy hasn't fucking done that in a while. <laughs> Don't nap right here. We need to get to moving. Oh, uh, but it's fine. I'm on the carpet. Move. Are we? Yeah. <laughs> Did we get the carpet, the carpet? Oh, okay. I took it out, yes. <laughs> let's okay. let's get out of here. Right. There's a difference between grass and carpet, right? It's also going to be wet carpet within five minutes, so... Uh... I'm gonna put the sheet over drug, the rubber sheet over drug, yeah. so he can at least stay dry. If it's no, no, if it's if it's wet carpet, you just is sucking on it. <laughs> Ooh, <wow. laughs> wait, wait, before we, do we even know where we're going? We gotta keep going up the road north to. Uh, oh, we so we're not chasing the rock right. that we're hunting. Has quick question: Has Coin shared the pings he's been getting or no? Nope. Okay. I mean, well, so, okay, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Backing up a little bit. We keep talking about the rock and the contract. I Are those really important at the moment? I mean, We've encountered a dragon, a full dragon that we were tasked by the prince to take care of. Doesn't that take precedence regardless of whether it's the target of our contract? Well, we don't have a way of tracking it. All we know is it went in a general direction. It could have changed directions. Shouldn't it's miles we... away by now. I mean, shouldn't we at least try? 
it presumably, if it infected this town, it presumably has a lair nearby that it's probably retreated back to. Oh, it's so loud. When you guys said it went west, didn't you? Let's just get going west. It's through the swamp and such. You need to go in off road into the swamp. Isn't there a river up north a bit? Can we get to the river and travel along the river? It's still be, it's still be, it's still swampy river. Never mind. I think we do need to track the dragon. I think we need to handle that now, effectively, before we sleep again. Listen, it's highly I, hurt. We were. I, if I, I wasn't missing, I would have. It could have been killed. But it's, I pride myself on my ability to track things. Uh, In this weather, it is impossible to track anything. It's uh, what's never impossible. What's, what's everyone's... Impossible guys, by guys, any guys. means guys. that I am aware of. Caleb's been trying to talk. Oh, wow. Uh, what's... what's uh, who's who's missing health? What are you, what are you guys missing at? What's your, how close are you to full, Flitz? Uh, uh, 50 out of 70. Okay. Kenna? Uh, I'm Kenna. only down 17, so I can heal myself. Okay. I'm missing 31. 31, and Ben, are you missing any? 50, I'm down 54. You're down 54? I'm at 12 out of 66. <laughs> oh, holy Christ! Yeah. Speak up, my friend! Most of us heal! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Actually, one second. Are we taking a... We, have, we probably have a short rest. And, yeah, actually, Ven is going to... We haven't settled, it's, on, a it's, short, we haven't settled on a short rest yet. Right, but we're, we probably will have time, like, even if we're riding a car. But, okay, uh, Ven, is Coin, like, bring this up? Yes, or, like, I guess... I guess, uh, in character... Just kind of sizing up because I saw like some healing going on. Looking mm -hmm. around, are you like hobbling, <laughs> or like just like I, <laughs> he's probably he's probably because like all of the most of those wounds happened when he was trying to like get to Flitz to heal him. So he was like leaned over the rock when these like things swarmed behind him and just started shredding his back. So like he's probably not noticing just like the his like back is just <laughs> drenched in red and like his shirt is just tatters. So, Coin is going to put the 25 hit points that I have lay on hands into your back. Oh, wait, 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 what, wait, what are you doing? What am I doing? Yes. What am I, what am I doing? Yes. The dragon, he went northwest. Let's go hunting. Oh, 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 oh. oh we'll save your healing. Coin then. just uh, tumped the adult silver dragon potion. Fucking right. Uh, okay. And as before, fucking like, right. start, yes. starts to turn into the adult silver dragon. Jump on. Okay. Uh, Ven is oh, going fuck. to. Yeah. <laughs> Ven, Ven is going. Ven is going to deny coins healing. Actually, he's going to use his own. Then. All right. <laughs> no, no, okay. I've got this. And he's going to put a hand on himself. Fucking and he's going to cool. cast the first time heal. Man, what was the name of that potion again? Uh, I can't remember. There's... Give me a second. I have to go through my notes. I wrote it down. Potion of Dragon's Majesty. How long does it, la long does it last for? It lasts for one hour. I thought oh. it was an. I thought it was an indefinite thing. No, it's. it's whenever, it's whenever for an Coin hour. mentioned it, yeah. Whenever oh, Coin initially so we, mentioned it, I thought it was like in game. Are, are you sure you don't so, want to wait until we? No, no. We, if, catch we up? don't. We don't want this thing to get a short rest. We need to go. So Coin. Well, right. But you shape change. So you. Use a stat block for a adult silver dragon. Mm -hmm. uh, you retain your languages, personality, and memories, but you use a dragon stat block. You just don't get its legendary or lair actions. So coin turns into an adult silver dragon. Just oh dear. The so coin can full on carry all of us right yes. now, right? Well, um, all right. With a fly speed of eighty, so if I dash, yeah. that's one sixty. But then... also, it is the wind. So you're gonna have to land at the end of each of your turns. Yeah. Oh right. Whatever. But Just what, don't ever but, get that high. <laughs> but Kenna, when you were talking to Druck about things. Yeah. A Stuff voice happening. a voice creeped into your head. And the storm stops. So is it just me that the storm doesn't no. stop? No, it stopped. Like the storm's done. It's a cleared spring day. 
What did the voice say? Did I just I hear like- it, I sent it to you. Oh, you sent it to me. <laughs> Sorry, my Discord is silenced, so. Oh, so is mine. <laughs> we don't get notifications. And then as soon awesome. as you hear that, that's when the storm stops. And coin is now a dragon. It has an hour time limit on it. Yeah, I was gonna say, with, with no offense to anyone's human brains processing things fast, I'd like to make sure we get the most out of this hour-long flight. Oh, yeah. So if that yeah, could happen... And also, we only have a half hour left of the session, so yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. We'll see. I'm just, yeah, I'm just saying, well, yeah, we mm -hmm. do, because I, <laughs> I gotta sleep. Uh, but, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let in, let's... Yeah, proceed. climb aboard. Climb aboard, so every six seconds, we're flying okay. off. Okay. 160 okay, feet. Okay, okay, okay. Catch up to this okay. guy. Uh, okay, let me pull out a travel calculator real quick. Because this totally, oh, this totally overgoes the, uh... There's no way it's expecting this. Oh, it's fucked. <laughs> Surprise, <laughs> motherfucker! <laughs> yeah. But the potion is used up. Uh, how fast are you going? So 100 and you're going, yeah, okay. 160 feet um, every six seconds. Yeah. So every minute, that's um, uh, 1,600 feet. Yeah, so 1,600. I'm trying to figure out what that's going to be in miles. 1,600 uh, times 60 miles per hour. That's not right at all. Uh, wait, wait, okay, wait, hold on. I can't yeah, remember how to figure it. It's, one, it's one, times, it's one 160 10. It's times 10. Is, is how many feet per minute. Yeah, so I need to figure out, uh, so much mass. 1600 feet per minute times yeah. another 60 is 96,000 feet per hour divided by 5,280 is 18 miles per hour. Okay. 18 miles in an hour. Okay. God, I'm so happy we have a math teacher. <laughs> Alright, cool. I also had a monk in my last party who liked to crank speed all the way up, so I had to do that calculation a lot. Were you, was it a sonic monk? No. So, Love chili you dogs. race, you <laughs> bolt up into the, the storm ends, you bolt up into the sky on the back of coin as a silver dragon and start chasing, <laughs> flying in a northwestern direction. Mm -hmm. Limping through the forest and also bursting through the trees uh, about maybe 100 feet up ahead <laughs> is this injured dragon. And it looks back, and I need everyone to roll initiative again. This is going to be an air fight on the back of a dragon. I, oh, I love the idea of these dragons just leapfrogging. Oh, wait, they aren't leapfrogging no, anymore because now. the storm's over. So the green dragon has the storm's its full, done. The dragon got its full fly speed back. Yeah. Too. Mm hmm. It just thought it was out of the woods in the clear. At least that no bitch. No. Alright, so coin. <laughs> no, so coin is. To quote Taylor Swift. Coin's not in this encounter as a character. It's a silver dragon, so I'm removing coin from this encounter and adding an adult silver dragon. Great. Okay. We. 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 We're all on this. We're all on this roller coaster uh, together, it guys. Did, it did take arms a, up. It would have taken an. It would have taken. It would have taken an hour to get to where you are. So everybody but coin would have gotten a short rest, but also coins a fucking adult silver dragon, so. We also you can re wrestle traveling, so everybody gets a short rest of butt coin. Okay. Ooh, that's helpful. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. going to... That gives me my sixth level spell slot back. Roll hit dice. Do you have an adult silver dragon stat block ready to go, coin? Oh yeah, I pulled it up. Thank All right, you. cool. Alrighty. Fuck. It'll awesome. just take. I might have to look a couple times to make sure I get the breath weapon and yeah. things like you're, that. But... You're. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, I forgot you had that thing. What a good yep. time to use it. Thank you. Oh, man, I was gonna do it by myself, but no one it's so cool. wanted to rest, so I was like, "Fuck it, we're all going." All right. So uh, we go down. We go down together. Coin. Roll a d20. Don't add anything I to it for your initiative. Uh, don't add anything yep. to it. This is my initiative. Silver Dragon has a zero. To it's a zero zero dex. Bonus. Yeah. Rip. Uh, that is a thirteen. Okay. Druk, what'd you get for initiative? Sorry, I'm rolling uh, my okay. hit point things. Uh, I believe I it got... Was a 21. 21? Yes, cool. a 21. Kenna. Uh, 17. Alright, Dax. 16. Ven. 
Uh, 11. 11. Flitz. Uh, I swear I rolled it. Oh, 14. 14. Coin, how high up do you want to be? Um, the green dragon just bur- the dragon the green dragon just burst through the treetops, so it's uh, about um, it's about a hundred feet in the air. Oh, oh! If it's a hundred feet in the air, I, I'm like I want I, I was thinking like I'm hot skimming like a bullet to get max distance like a line drive baseball. Like a bomber. Hit. So, but like if it's bomber. but I'm I guess I'm coming up at it yeah, at it, an it, upward it, angle to hit. Uh, it, so if it's you would have the tree line. You would have or... been above the trees for a long time because huh. you guys were flying. You can't fly through the trees. Uh, yeah, yeah. This I'd thing like just this thing just broke through the tree line, so it's it just fl- it started to fly. So you'd be oh, above so, you'd be above it. Uh, I, I mean, and, yeah. So I, I the goal, yeah, just being like if there are like eighty to ninety foot trees standardly. Yeah. Like I'm I'm flying like maybe a, a hundred and ten, but like right across, like yeah. making sure that nothing can hide in the trees. Or okay, I'm just I'm just trying to figure out your height compared to this guy. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I mean, if it's just personality, like, I, yeah, I was riding across the tops. Yeah. Okay, so you're the same height above the trees, 100 feet uh, away yeah. from this dragon. Okay. Yeah. Druk, you're first, 100 feet away. Yeah, Druk is uh, going to steady aim and attack. Go for it, 100 feet away. Uh, Ability checks, not attacks. Okay, so I can still do advantage. All right. Natural 20! Nice. Oh, this thing is a nat 20 magnet. Are you kidding me? Yeah, <laughs> it, really, it really bums me out. But yeah, go for it. Uh, okay, so that is 16 and... Six. Uh... Plus. And you didn't say sharpshooter, so. Correct. Correct. <laughs> uh, so that's um. A lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Um. That's uh. Quick maths. Yeah, 48 plus 16 plus 10. So that's 26. 60. 74. 70, 74. Yeah, 74. All right, cool. It's looking to hurt after 70, that. It, yes. it does look like it replenished itself somehow. Not enough time to have a short rest, but it did heal itself somehow. Okay. But, and you do notice from, uh, from this distance, you can see one of the other glyphs has vanished. So it probably use yeah. a spell to heal itself. Yeah. Druk, uh, the shot would have aimed directly, like, at the kind of shoulder muscle for one of its wings right. to try and slow it down. Um, but, I mean, that's just flavor yeah. for what Druk would have done, not any mechanical effect, yeah. just yeah. saying. Yeah. Uh, Ven, the glyph, you would recognize as the heal spell. Oh, okay. So we got about 70, 70 hit points, points yeah. That Druk basically just deleted. All right. Yep. Anything else? Boom! Right back. Anything else? Uh, me? no, no. That's both my bonus action and action and my movement. I'm not gonna move on this yeah. dragon. I'm hanging on tight. All Fuck right, that. Cool. <laughs> Kenna, you're 100 feet away from this dragon. Cool. I'm 100 feet. Yep. Um, phantasmal killer, range of 120. Uh, wisdom saving throw at disadvantage, please. Does it have to be on the on the ground to do that? No, I'm thinking of something else. No. Yeah, I'm thinking of a different spell. All right. I, I tap into the nightmares of a creature I can see. Um, okay. So I'm gonna. It's gonna see an illusory. Uh, uh, Sixteen plus seven. Fuck. Just shrugs <laughs> it off. Well, on a failed save, uh, the tar- uh, on a successful save, the spell and oh, wait. Oh, it doesn't even take any damage no. on a success. Yeah, nothing. No. Nothing. Damn. It's one of those ones. It's one of saver those spells. Suck. Fourth yeah. level saver suck? That's yeah. bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, anything else? Saver yeah. suck. Anything else? <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, normally it's only cantrips. Man. Yeah. Um, it took it. It did that at disadvantage? Yeah. Dragons got some decent wisdom to them. 
and other things. Mm-hmm. They got mental yeah. statistics. They're good for that. Yeah. Um, I can't relate. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I have any other bonus action shit. Um, it's an action to interact with an item, yeah? Yes, like to it drink is. a potion? Yes, it is. Cool. Um, I'm just gonna keep holding on. Alright. Dax, you're 100 feet away. Uh, I think the only thing I can do at this point in time is just aim with Drux crossbow at it. All right. I love the idea of you just taking Drux crossbow off of him. Like, give me that shoot. No, Drux gave it to Dax. <laughs> gave it to me. Nine doesn't hit. Uh, <laughs> and yeah, it's just into the wind. Yeah, that bolt's gone. And he didn't retrieve the other bolts you shot, so yeah, this one. No, I yeah, it's gone. <laughs> I'm not used to you shooting hear, the thing. You hear oh a yelp God. from down below, like, Ugh! No. <laughs> you don't. Anything else? You can't really do anything else. Yeah, I can't, I can't do All right, anything. Flitz, 100 feet away from this thing. Okay. Holy shit, everyone rolled above a 13? Yeah. yeah. God damn. Yeah. Coin, you're up next. Um, you're up next, though, Coin. I'm ready. The dragon's up next. Okay. Um, oh, I'm so excited for this. Uh... Yeah, this is... Mm, okay. Flitz is going to... Uh, bonus action. Yep. Uh, he is going to quicken spell a greater invisibility, and he's going to touch cool. the scales cool. of the silver dragon. Roll percentile dice. Oh, shit. Get a fireball. <laughs> Get a fireball. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. <laughs> Oh no. Okay, eighty-three. Okay, no wild magic surge. So oh, that would have been great. <laughs> coin is, and everything he's carrying, is invisible now. Wouldn't be you guys. He's not carrying us. You can't. Make, we're, you we're, can't we're creatures, not objects. Yeah, it's objects. It doesn't say you. objects. It just says anything it's carrying. I'm Where are you carrying? I'm okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, fine. So we just all, look like we're floating. You're floating on an invisible um, silver dragon. I was gonna say, are they are they Wonder Womaning? Yeah, now? basically, <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. Love that. Um, invisible jet. And he is. He's just gonna do a little bit more damage to ensure that. Okay. Just a little bit more. Um, we'll see how many of these actually hit, and eighteen doesn't hit. What are you doing? Thirteen doesn't hit, and Elder's Blast. Elder's Blast. Okay. Actually, none of these are going to fucking hit because I can't roll shit with my Eldritch Blast okay. right now. So you, yeah, 16. You, you, <laughs> nope. you make coin the Silver Dragon invisible. You cast, I I told him no one. You cast some Eldritch Blast. Yeah, hopefully everyone's holding on because you can no longer see where the dragon begins and ends. Mm-hmm. All right, bringing us to coin the adult Silver Dragon. Uh, I'm gonna fly, uh, sh- uh, shore up the distance. Yeah, you, so get, 60 you get up, feet. you get right up, you get, yeah, yeah, 60 feet. So you get, uh, so he's 40 feet away. Or she's 40 feet away. Uh, mm. I have mixed feelings, because I can either do damage or I can paralyze this fool. Um, and you also, you, don't, you, you also don't get ac- access to his chain shape action. Right. I didn't, I didn't think. I, I, I really, I highly <laughs> doubted that oh. one. Um, it turns into a person. Odds are <laughs> odds cold. Okay, cool. Um, so, uh, Coin is going to. You start. Uh, you don't see anything, but you guys start feeling cold coursing up from the back of the silver dragon to the front of it you don't know like it just it like drops it's like you're on the hogwarts express and there are dementors around and you just everything like you start to see your breath that like crystallizes and then you hear in a loud booming voice and just you see like a the, the snow storm uh chase after the green dragon and I need yeah. you to make a uh, cool. uh, saving throw so please. out of the invisible dragon you just see a cone of cold just yeah it, like con- convalesces yeah. and just like uh, con- for those of us that don't speak draconic what was that? 
Well, you, yeah, that's uh, uh, it's half of the phrase that he said at the beginning of the battle as he <laughs> revealed himself. Uh, that beginning phrase was, "You are trash, and I am the garbage man." Nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> as he screams, snow and ice. Uh, you just hear in a deep, roaring voice, I am the garbage man. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. Uh, that's a, that's, unfortunately, that's a 24 for the con save, so it's half damage. Half damage? I'll roll so it. So roll 13d8. 13d8 cold damage. Yeah, I'll get you. Oh, man. <laughs> that's so you. good. Thank you. <laughs> I knew I was asking for, like, a I'm meta trash, reason. man. But... Fuck, that's so worth it. <laughs> Alright, so 47, so half of 47, I believe. 20, if we're rolling down, it's either 23. 23. If we're rolling up, it's 24. It's always rounded down, so 23. Right. So 23. this cold breath just <laughs> coalesces around this green dragon, and it looks like fucking shit. Mm -hmm. uh, also, roll a d6 to see if you recharge your breath weapons. Let's do it. Because you got, you can only use one of those breath weapons. Then you breath roll weapons. What is? Is it? Uh, does it do it on five? Recharges five to six. Boom! So you get your breath weapons back. So you, you can, yeah. So you, just remember, uh, you, you can only use one of those at a time, and then you have to achieve you recharge your breath weapons. Metallic dragons Perfect. are cool as fuck because they get multiple breath weapons usually. Uh, all right. Anything else? You don't really have a bonus action as a dragon. Yeah. Yeah, I, was gonna say, I don't think I have no. a bonus action. No. Nope. And I don't think, since it's a potion, I don't think it gives me legendary actions, or does it? It doesn't. You don't get any of the legendary actions or legendary resistances. Or legendary resistances. Yeah. Otherwise, right. that would That's what I fucked. thought. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I was going to say, that'd be... <laughs> already kind of is, but, you know. Yeah, it's already pretty powerful. Imagine yeah. using this on the mouth. What the fuck? Anyways, Ven. <laughs> yeah. You're up. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. It's, it's 40 uh, feet away it... now. 40 feet it's away. It's like covered Perfect. in like ice sickles that are like forming under the wings from like the blood that's been freezing from the cold breath. All right. Uh, I'm going to do what I wanted to do to it last time, but I couldn't get line of sight on it. Disintegrate. Uh, no, I don't have it prepared uh... today. Uh, no, I'm going to I'm gonna summon a Big B's hand directly in front of it so yes. that it just flies right into it, and I'm going to go to grapple. Okay. Because when a creature yeah. is grappled, their speed drops to zero, and when a flying creature's speed drops to zero... They fall. They well, fall. How big this hand flies? Well, right, but can it? If the if the creature, I don't think it's big. I, if the if dragon, Bigby, speed, I don't think, yeah, I don't think Bigby's hand could hold it up. Also, if Bigby's hand's move speed becomes zero, it also drops. <sighs> well, I'm gonna grapple. It and no see what magical, Let's see magical. It. Bigby hands. Bigby's hand stays in the air no matter what. Okay. Uh, oh, it, it can hold the dragon. I mean, that's I'm, fine. I'm looking up. Like, what's it? What's it? Does Bigby's hand have like a carrying capacity on it? It has a strength of 26, and it's large. So it is one size category smaller than the dragon. Um, yeah. So you can grapple it. What can it yeah, so you can still grapple uh, it, but... I'm trying to figure out carrying capacity real quick. It's 26 times 15 times right. 2. Thank you. Yeah. 780 so, pounds. Oh yeah, it cannot hold the dragon. Yeah, so if it grapples it, it'll go with the dragon, then, right? <laughs> Whee! Yeah, that's okay. There it is. Uh, right. Suplex a dragon, and that's what I want to do. All right, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna go, it's gonna go acrobatic. Uh, it's gonna go strength. I was just acrobatics, really. Yeah, it's gonna go strength. Uh, okay. D twenty plus eight. Let's go. Uh, fifteen plus five. Fifteen. Fifteen plus eight. So twenty. Twenty-three. Ooh, 23. okay. 23. All right, I might not be able to beat that. Let's see. Come on, Sam. Well, I need, I need a, I need at least a sixteen because Come of on, the Sam. I also have a plus eight. No, that's a nat one. No! So it's just like, right. it, hit, it, hit, it hit, yeah, biggest hand, it just doesn't get grappled by biggest hand. Yep, okay. Oh, almost. Okay, but biggest hand is still there, like, throat. right in front of it, yeah. Okay, cool. Bink. Cool, <laughs> cool, 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 cool. The dragon's gonna pivot in the air and come flying back and just breathe a breath weapon down the oh, back that of makes the dragon. Sense. Oh, boy. He's gonna go above coin to get out of attack reach and then just breath weapon down coin's back and all of the people on the back. Nice. I need sense. everyone to make constitution saving throws. Oh boy. Coin, you need to make two of these. Yeah. You all have plus oh. one. Uh, yes. Uh, nice. no, because you don't have access to your paladin abilities while you're in the dragon form. Oh, mm. you, that, don't, you, yeah, don't have, you don't have access to your class features, so no one gets a plus yeah. one on this. If I'm, uh, if I'm also, if I'm invisible, does that give me no. advantage not, not for this on kind this? Of stuff. <laughs> not for this kind of stuff. Just asking. Just got, I gotta <laughs> ask the questions. 
Uh, all right, so it's a con save, you yep, say? Yeah, DC 18. So Flitz needs to make two con saves, correct? We'll see. All right, for a greater invisibility. All right, so Ven, what'd you get? I get it. Dirty 20. You succeed, so you take 34 poison damage. Oh! Uh, Kenna, what'd you get? I got a 15. You take 68 poison damage, but you'll reduce to 34 because of your belt. Coin, what'd you get? I rolled a 16 plus 7 is 23. Oh, you take 34 cold, uh, poison damage. Uh, out of the dragon's hit points, correct? Correct, Amundo. So you would go from. I'm not going to bother rolling those. They say you're at, you you're can at, do you're 18 at, you're D12. At, you're, at two, you're at 243. If you just yeah, so base, minus you the 30. 34. Minus so. the 34. Uh, Dax, what'd you get? <laughs> that one. 68 poison damage. Oh, oh. it's the half. 34. Because your resistance. Druck. 17 plus 3, 21 because of coin. No, oh, wait, no, not no, because no. of coin. So 20, dirty 20. 34, uh, 34 poison damage. Okay. Flitz. 34. Natural 20 for a 21. Wow, that would have been 68 poison damage. You have 70 hit points. 30, <laughs> yeah. 34. Okay, I'll roll my con save at advantage. <laughs> Let's see if this works. No. Oh, it did work! I rolled an 18! I need so, to roll a 17! Wow, that's what you needed. So, uh... Yeah! So, uh, I still have the so greater invis Still invisibility! <laughs> and it also recharges its breath weapon. Uh, coin, uh -oh. dragon, it flew, it has a flying speed of... 40? Or... Uh, 80. So, it's... What? Yeah. Dashing? Yeah, yeah. That's right. So, just as fast no, 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 no. as us. It's 80. So, it's, it's, oh, it's, okay. it's an adult dragon, it's just as fast. Oh! Oh, I did the wrong, uh, number... Earlier, I said I only flew 60 feet because I thought it was 60. I would have flown well, you have 20 distance. It doesn't, yeah, it doesn't really well. affect you. So, uh, it would fly, so it, it would be, it's 40 feet behind you. It flew behind you. Yeah, it 40 pivoted feet. and turned yeah. around 40 feet behind me. Sure. All right. Got it. That's its turn. Druck. Uh, I'm going to do it again. All right. <laughs> Uh, so, um, because there's really no hiding on an invisible dragon. <laughs> you, you, uh, you wouldn't be able to hide in this encounter anymore. Yeah, so bonus action, steady aim, yeah. no movement, that consumes my movement. Um, yeah, uh, and that is a 29 to hit. Uh, that hits. All right. So that is... A uh, thirteen uh, for piercing damage. Uh, six for electric damage, and I'm using the uh, charge. Yep. So it needs to make a uh, con save. Con con save. Yeah. Uh, eighteen. Okay, it succeeds. I figured I might as well use one, at least one of my charges. I'd feel bad if I didn't use any. Um, and then sneak attack because I had advantage. Uh, twenty-eight additional damage on top All of that. Alrighty, cool. Anything else? I mean, that's bonus action and action yep. nope. and movement because Same. my bonus action. Yep like yep. used up my movement yep. so that's everything Kenna. it's um, 40 feet behind you now yeah you know what I'm just gonna go with a cantrip because I'm running low on spell slots um, and I want to be able to heal people so wisdom save for Toll the Dead Woo! at disadvantage uh, with disadvantage that's a 13 plus 7 uh, that saves no damage um did anyone who's looking rough? Who wants hit points? Wouldn't say no. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Healing word on Ben, first level. Uh the dragon's gonna counterspell it. Ooh. Asshole. And you see one of the other glyphs go away. Well, you know what? I guess if I can use up one of his spell a third level spell slot with a first, I'm fine with that. Um cool. Sorry, Ben. 
Uh, that's my turn. <laughs> All right, Dax, it's 40 feet away. We have diamonds, right? Oh, yeah, a bunch. Oh. Okie dokie. You're 100 feet up. <laughs> I am going to far step onto its back. As a bonus action. Alright, you're not grappling it, so you could just there are fall rules for, off. There, there are actually rules for landing on top of a larger creature uh, in the DMG. It's, it's, <laughs> it's the opposite. Sam. I can tell you, it's really, it's really simple. It's the opposite of grappling. So it's basically the attacker, the, the one trying to land on the creature needs to uh, can either use acrobatics or athletics, and the one, the larger oh, one, I think, can only defend with acrobatics, I think is what that it is. That makes sense. Alright. Yeah. Athletics but it's also a giant fucking dragon. No, it's oh, yeah. huge, but it's, a huge it's also dragon. a dragon. <laughs> and you're technically, We're fighting dragons, it's like, y'all. It's not like time stops when, when you're Guys. on your turn. It is in the midst of flight while you're trying to teleport on it. Mm -hmm. Guys. Fair. We are we are fighting the dr the dragons in Dungeons and Dragons right now. That guys. is a mm -hmm. natural twenty for a Oof. twenty. Oh, wrong. Yeah, twenty six. And can Dax even make that? Yeah, because far step sixty feet. Okay. Oh, you mean the th yeah. yeah? I can. Make your checks. Athletics or acrobatics? Athletics. Go for it. Need to be to twenty six. No! Dax, no! Dax plummets 100 feet and hits the forest floor. Oh, that's bullshit! So, Dax, you take... from falling 100 feet. And D6. Yeah, and prone in the forest. 38 bludgeoning damage. And oh, you would, you would land in the swamp. So I need you to make a constitution saving throw as you land in the swamp. In the water. Because oh. the water's tainted. Hey. Oh, okay. 20? You do. Water. You succeed. But you're prone, 100 feet <laughs> down. You it. look up, and you can't see the dragons. I love it that our most stout person is just like, <laughs> fucking swamp. <laughs> yeah. I drink yeah. it up! So, you, you <laughs> far step, miss, and just plummet into the. Well, you land on the dragon, but it, you sh it shakes you off, and you plummet and land 100 feet down in the swamp. Your friends are 100 feet up. You can't see either dragon from where you are, and you're prone. So that was your action. That was your bonus action to do far step. You're in the swamp, 100 feet down. Can't see anybody. Ah. Uh, oh, uh, concentration check for far step. It's a bonus action. You're concentrating on the spell, though. So you need to make a constitution saving throw for I'm it. I'm not used to doing the spells. I don't understand so, them. I'm a con barbarian. Constitution saving throw. Okay. Your DC uh, is 19. You are no longer concentrating yeah, no. on far step. So you poof, okay. and far step's gone. Anything else? Can, can, you're prone, can you're, I, you're submerged in the water, so you are technically drowning at this point. Can I swim out of the swamp? You can stand up, and you're ten feet in the swamp, and you just see swamp for miles in all direction. Uh, I, I'm going to stand you're, up you at guys least, are right so in the I'm middle not of it. drowning. Okay, you're... So every turn you're in this water, it's constitution. Anyways. Anything else? You know what? If that would have worked, it would have been real fucking it been great. cool, guys. It would have been cool. Anything else? I, I guess not. All right, Flitz. You all just see everyone. You all see Dax four step onto the dragon, land, and then no, 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 no. no. <laughs> oh, no. You know what? I count this as a success because I'm not dead. Um... It feels really bad, but he can't take another hit like that. Um, thank okay, you. He thank is... you, Sam. I wish I could search things up in the books. Mm -hmm. He yeah, is the going search to... function doesn't work very well. He is going to quick and spell a fireball. A fireball? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna roll uh, roll for it. Roll okay. deck save, and then roll your roll your percentile dice right now. Okay. Please get a fireball centered on yourself too. No, please don't. Okay, that's a hundred. Okay, you're good. All right, nice. so that's a deck save, yeah. It's a deck save eighteen. Uh, five plus six. It's gonna use legend. It's second legendary resistance to. 
that's 96. So yeah. that is. Oh my god, there's two dice on top of each other. Oh, I hate when that just happens. Make a, just make a decision, guys. <laughs> Get off of each other. I can't. Okay, that's 39. Reduce to half, because it used legendary resistance. Uh huh. Okay. And he is going to do another round of Eldritch Blast at it. Alright. So the fireball explodes and you launch some Eldritch Blast into oh it. Oh my god. Yeah, Eldritch well, Blast are not as loving me you, today. As you launch your three Eldritch Blasts. Nope. All three of them miss. How do you want to do this? Because the fireball did it. Damn it. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Um, I, he, I, in Draconic, he, I don't know if, he, Flitch would probably have aimed to try to get, if coin had horns he probably would have been like on the headpiece or as mm -hmm. close to like because he's the smallest one so if he flies back hopefully somebody in the back will catch him but he's going to kind of like as he's going to cast a spell he's going to interconic say i'm sorry but i have to do this and he's going to point back and the dragon as it's going to if it's going to go like lift and like turn again He's going to catch it right at that moment where it goes to curve, and he's going to do it, like, right at the base of the neck. Okay. Just where the, where the bead hits right. right there and just explodes well, out. In Fizz Bands, when a dragon dies, there's a such thing called a dragon death throw to see what happens. So let's see what happens. The D6 oh roll. Roll What's on the mean? wild magic surge table. Uh -oh. Oh. oh. That's fun. Okay. All right. So, I imagine everyone is in with, is within, like, within a certain amount of range, range no matter radius. what yeah, happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Except for Dax! Except Dax! Except Dax! <laughs> Except Dax. <laughs> Alright. That is a... You're all frightened by the nearest creature until the end of your next turn, so you're all frightened of each other. Ah! <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to do this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but as, we're all frightened of coin. But, uh, <laughs> we're just like slapping since, what we're writing. Since Dax fell, the dragon. This is happening. This is the exact moment Dax fell. The dragon's body is falling towards Dax. Dax. <laughs> there's rules for this too. Oh I'm fuck! Oh fuck! Oh now. fuck! Oh shit! Run, bitch. There is rules for this, and then she fell directly under the dragon. The dragon's gonna plummet down onto Dax. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> That's how it went. How it went. And it is in the rules. So if you got a problem with it, talk to Jeremy Crawford, not me. Mm. And that's all I'm gonna say on that. Also, Dax can handle it. I can take it. Alright, Dax, make a dexterity saving throw to see if you can reduce the damage with this dragon falling on you. Oh, I might not be able to take it. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, fuck. Come on, Dax. It, Come it's on, it's only seeing if you have the falling damage the dragon's gonna... The, Corpse is gonna take. <laughs> Dex save, you said? Yeah. Uh, and would you say I can see yeah, this? Yeah, you see the dragon plummeting through the canopy. So I can do it at advantage. Okay. Yeah. Um. Oh god, nat 20. I mean, okay. nat 20 for a 22. Okay. You take 12 bludgeoning damage. Oh. And the okay. dragon drops. Just... <laughs> and as the dragon. And as the dragon slams into the ground. That's where we're gonna end the session for the week. Full combat. Blitz killed his first and dragon. And coin. And coin. Even though the dragon's dead, you can still feel the orb, the, the fragment pinging, still northwest. And that's where we're gonna end the session for the week. So, oh, no. dragon's dead. 